Hello, hello, welcome to the podcast. And we have another round of guests, the youngins in royal blood. Let's welcome James, Princess, and Aidan. Oh, diba talk show na to? <laughs> Let's go. The pressure time. The pressure time. <laughs> <laughs> All right, James, Princess, and Aiden, welcome to our yay. home. Oh, yay! What's up? High fives, high fives, high fives. And yay. even Soba is wel- welcoming uh, all three of you. Mm. This is the most that we've had on the podcast. Yeah, usually so one guest. Guests. Yeah, one guest love me usually. Oh. Pero I'm very excited because, syempre, you guys were lumped together as the youngins and the kids in the royal blood. The sparkle and teens. Yung sparkada, kung baga. Sparkada ba kayo? Sparkle, sparkle teens. teens. Uh, iba pa yun. Iba pa yun. Okay, explain that to me later. Um, <laughs> but we have so much to talk about simply because I told James a while ago, hindi kami nakapag-usap during the show. Yeah, yeah. I think this is gonna be the longest conversation that we've ever had. And maybe, Aidan, we've talked a bit. Kasi yeah, yeah. yun nga lang, we've had many scenes yeah, together. Yeah. But at the same time, parang kulang pa rin eh, no? Yeah, yeah. Kasi puro tulog din. <laughs> puro tulog. Si number, tulog number one na sa tulog si Aidan. Akala nyo, ako mahilig matulog. Number one talaga siya. Okay. Siya, siya pinakamatagal matulog sa amin. So usually, pag nasa tent ba kayo, how long does Aidan sleep? Longest uh, na nakita ko siya, parang four hours na natulog sa... Four hours lang. Mas matagal yeah, yung per... first taping day. Yeah, yeah. Oh. The first taping day that we ever had for Royal Blood. First time kitang mamit hmm. from the story conference. Parang tulog ka sa biyahe, sa mga one and a half hours. Pagtating niya ng set, right. natulog siya. Pero buong araw siya natulog. So isipin niyo siguro mga 12 hours. <laughs> tulog siya sa set. <laughs> At gabi pa siya nakuna ng exit na. So, Pur- yeah. like l- night lang yung single that yes. uh, first day ko. Kaya tulog ako the whole day. So in short, boy tulog ka. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, but Boris, is this really our chance to get to know James, Princess, and Aidan? Mm-hmm. But I guess before even getting to know them per se, let's talk about Royal Blood. Oh, oh. Let's Ooh. start from there. Kasi ang laki ng hype from Royal Blood and each of your characters sobrang nagkaroon ng significance dun sa show natin. Simulan natin kay Louis. Louis! Hey. Hey. You are not my man. Why'd you do that to Diana? You sorry, did Diana sorry. dirty. Sorry. <laughs> Wala na siya. No. Na. Sorry na lang. Nag-sorry naman eh. Sorry for what? Sorry for what? So how did you feel nung Isa ka sa mga choices pala para mag-execute pala kay Diana. Okay? Yeah, and not just that, how did you feel about your characters from start to finish? Kasi nagbago lahat ng characters natin, mm-hmm. diba? And lalo na for you, both of you. And then Aiden, of course, well, your character always had a very special place in the hearts of the audience. Yeah. So, let's start with you, James. Well, actually, how did you feel? Actually, nung nakausap ko po si Coach Ruth, ang una ko po talagang natanong sa kanya kung may impact po ba talaga sa tao yung magiging character ko. Kasi, yung mga, yung nagiging ugali ko from the start papunta sa dulo nag-iiba mm. so nakukuha ko sa inyo yun sa mga pag-aaway ninyo sa violence ninyo sa inyo ko nakuha yun oh that's oh. really interesting so Louis was technically feeding off of the energy yeah. sa mga adults mm. opo kasi I would see you as ano eh parang bratinela lang noon mm. nung umpisa kasi naaway mo si Archie pero <laughs> interesting na sinasabi mo yun kasi I guess in real life yung mga kids or yung mga yeah. teens, they really get this kind of angst from the people around them hmm. also. Pero on a personal level, curious ako, kasi I, I think you didn't know kung ano yung mangyayari kay Louie as the character, no? So, ano yung naramdaman mo personally? Kasi may feelings yan, syempre, di ba? At first, yes, syempre, pakit. Yung namin ni Diana. All the way to the end. At first, kasi, uh, pakit ka lang, di ba? Happy, happy ka lang. Then later on, biglang bumibigat na yung may eksena mo, especially towards the end. So, ano yung una mong naramdaman? Natanggap mo ba yun agad? Na-shock ka ba? Natakot ka ba? Because I'm sure it's very different. Like, looking at your scene, like, ha, huh, ganito pala yung character ko. So, how did you feel? Medyo natakot po ako kasi sa lahat po ng mga naging show po, naiiba po talaga si Louis sa lahat ng mga okay. naging character ko. Uh, I felt the pressure, yung takot mm. na baka mamaya underperformed yung mm. magagawa ko. Natural naman yung feelings na But we'll get back to those feelings a bit later on. Let's move on to Princess na. Okay, so si Princess, <laughs> si Anne. Anne. Anne, ano, palaway ko kay B. <laughs> Ako dun sa dynamic nyo kasi without knowing dun sa dulo na kapatid mo nga si Sarah, parang I was like, bakit sobrang carefree 
ni Anne towards B. Mm-hmm. Bakit meron silang special uh, parang dynamic between each other? Because you don't see that with the other Royales uh, siblings dun sa mga kasambahay nila. It was just B and, uh, and Anne. So how did you feel going through that, those scenes with Lian? Um, actually, sobrang, ano, I'm not gonna say easy, pero parang nadalian ako dun. Kasi parang si Ate Lian, parang siyang Parang siya yung ate ko. So, like, si Anne, parang turnit na niya si B as her big sister. So, parang madali lang sa akin kasi, di ba, sometimes we fight. So, kapag kunyari, ina- iniisip ko na lang, kunyari, pag inaasar ako ng ate ko. So, parang, di ba, pag binama ko siya sa show. So, parang inaasar ko lang din yung totoong ate. So, yun, very easy lang. Ano kaya masasabi ng totoo mong ate dito? Ang <laughs> <laughs> relation mo na pag binama ko yung... Uy, so may ate ka talaga. <laughs> Oh, ah, ilan taon yung ate mo? Ah, uh, e- mag-18. Ah, okay. Ate, Di- 18 na pala. Ah, sino ba? Sino na? Nagot ka sa ate mo. Nagot ka. Pero para kasing more on ano ako eh, B's attitude. Tapos siya yung attitude mm. niya yung kay Ann. Yeah. So parang ako yung parang, Ayan ate, ano ba yung ganyan-ganyan? Ah. Tapos siya yung, okay, okay, sige na lang. Ganun. <laughs> Oh, may hugot ka pala. So it came naturally for yes, you. Po. Pero paano yun? Si Anne dun sa bandang huli, may darker side na lumabas. Kaya nga eh. Paano mo na-handle yun? Um, yung ang, ang ano sa akin, yung, yung sa hoodie, yung ginanda. Yeah. Oo. Oh, oh. in- Which FYI, favorite scene ni Bong Sin sa'yo. <laughs> Grabe. Can I, can I just say, nung napanood ko yung scene na tinatanggal mo yung hoodie mo na black para ipakita na ikaw yung nagsastock kay Napoy. Sabi ko, oh my god, what a star. Like, para kang action star. Mm-hmm. As in, as in. Slow mo pa, slow mo. Bida to. Bida. Kailangan makita ko tong si Princess na may, may show siya na siya yung bida na medyo action yung vibe. Mm-hmm. I really saw it in that moment. Black Rider it. Black Rider it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, ganun talaga yung vibe. So, I don't know why. Basta parang iba yung star quality mo dun sa scene na yun. It was superstar lang. Yes. Grabe. Okay. Anyway, getting back. So to that darker side nga. Ano yung naisip mo while going through those scenes? Or nung nabasa mo yung part na yun about Anne? Actually, nung nabasa ko yun, parang hindi kasi na-expect ko na na parang may twist sa huli si Anne. Eh. Pero hindi ko yun na-expect na kapatid niya pala si Sarah Oquendo. Mm. Akala ko connected siya sa mga royales, ganun. Pero like... Actually, nung ginawa namin yung scene na yun, ang nasa isip ko lang talaga, parang, ano, parang, parang killer ka, ganun. Mm-mm. Parang think uh-huh. like a killer. Tapos, parang, ano ba yung dark aura lang, ganun. Yun ang iniisip ko. Actually, kapag pinaprank ko yung ate ko, yung, yung ganun, parang, ano, parang Mas playful scary. na, parang yeah. scary, ganun. Yun ang iniisip ko. Ay, pinaprank mo lang pala yung mga royalties. <laughs> <laughs> Hindi, pero ako napaka-interesting yan. Kasi syempre, si James and si Anne are describing when they get to the heavier yeah. scenes, ano yung iniisip nila. Kasi syempre, tayo, hindi naman natin napagdaanan yun. 30 years old na tayo. So pag sinasabi nila, okay, you have a dark character. Syempre, iba yung hugot na. Ano na so nakakatawa rin na yan yung, yan yung pinanggagalingan nyo, yan yung iniisip nyo when you're starting to develop your character. And parang you see the, dis- the differences in parang, Yung natural age yeah. difference. Yeah. It just happens. The yung hugot is just different. Okay. I, I'm curious about Aidan naman. Because Aidan told me specifically na pag nagbabasa siya ng script, deliberately, mm. hindi niya binabasa yung scenes ng iba. Yeah. Basta kung ano yung scene na nandoon lang siya, yun lang. So hindi niya technically alam yung nangyayari around him. Mm. Because you wanted to keep the purity okay. of Archie. So... Can you explain more to us? And before before uh, Aiden answers that, I'm curious. Binabasa niyo ba yung buong script? Opo. Ano? Wow. <laughs> medyo, medyo. <laughs> no, it's okay. It's okay. It, everyone has their own thing. Siya, okay. hindi, hindi niya binabasa po. Ako, I find the script very interesting. Lalo na yung script ng Royal Blood. Kaya binabasa ko talaga. Kasi nanonood talaga ako sa TV. Eh. Yeah. Okay, okay. Oh, that's interesting. Oh, ikaw, Anne. Defend yourself. <laughs> yung ano yung scene ko lang talaga yung inaaral mm. ko pero kapag kunyari curious ako kung saan nang kung saan pinanggalingan tong scene na to bakit to nangyari binabasa ko yung iba pero hindi na. oh high five para sa tayo sige Alex may mga later but sige oh Aidan um yun nga you uh, had that technique or that deliberate way na hindi mo binabasa yung ibang parts can you explain bakit nga ganun yung style mo but at first nung uh, binigay sa akin script binasa ko siya 
Mm-hmm. Minabasa ko siya like nung week one, nung week two, or nung first, uh, parang hanggang week four yata yung binigay sa atin. Pero yung kinukunan pa kasi yata dati, hanggang week one or two or three mm-hmm. pa lang. So binabasa ko yung mga scenes kahit na hindi ako kasama. Pero nung nafe-feel ko na parang naapektuhan ako pag binabasa ko pa lang, yeah. yung parang pag ginagawa ko na yung scene, pag nasa taping na ako, nasa set na ako, ay, alam ko yung nangyari, ganto-ganto sila, tas feeling ko naapektuhan ako, tas um, dapat hindi naapektuhan yung karakter yeah. ko. Doon na ako parang nagkaroon ng uh, kinausap ko yung sarili ko. <laughs> kinaus- parang hindi, parang nag- sa salamin ba? Oh, 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 nag- oh, nag-decide ako na, oh, sige, parang try ko muna mag-focus sa mga scenes ko. Tingnan ako kung mag-work yun. Mm-hmm. Then, nung sinabi din ni Miss Ruth na parang goal sa karakter ko, I have to remain pure, innocent, and uh, genuine talaga sa lahat. That time, sabi ko, naisip ko na agad, ah, okay, sige, tama yung ginagawa ko. Tutuloy ko lang to. Then, ayun, hanggang sa ganun na lagi ginagawa ko dahil mas na-maintain ko yung uh, para wala akong alam sa nangyayari yeah. pag nag-take uh, tayo. Kasi madali akong maapektuhan pag reading the script pa lang. And yung sa uh, finale reading natin, uh, table reading natin, grabe ako na-affect nun. Kaya nung uh, nag-decide talaga ako na, okay, sige. Kasi like sa workshop kasi tinuturo sa amin na uh, dapat ma- uh, marunong kayong mag-dissect ng script, yes. mag-analyze nyo talaga yung script. Then, nung ina- siguro na-train din ako that time na talagang inaaral yung mga script kahit di ako kasama. Yeah. So, talagang na-affectuhan na-aff- talaga ako. So, Nung nalaman ko na dapat talagang mag, maging uh, pure lang talaga si Archie, di ba yung super light ng, yeah. ng vibe niya, ng energy niya, wala siyang, wala siyang heaviness yes. na, wala siyang alam sa nangyayari. So sabi ko, okay, sige, kailangan kong mag-decide talaga, kailangan mag, uh, gumawa ako ng decision kung ano yung work sa akin and for my character, then for the sake of my character. Right after the revelation ng kung sino yung killer yeah. ni Gustavo, Siyempre, alam na natin na lahat na si Margaret at si Diana. Nakita ko si Aidan, sobrang nataranta siya. Sabi niya, uh, uh, uh. Kasi feeling ko, habang binabasa mo, yeah. you're reading it as Archie, di ba? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you're Archie. reading as Archie. Tapos nung everything came in, oh my gosh, si Diana yung killer, si Margaret yung killer. You were taking that in as Archie. As Archie. Kaya, nag-freak out siya. Nag-freak out siya. Yeah. siya. Hindi so, sabi mo, I have to go, I have to go. Goodbye. Kasi oh. hindi namin nakita si Aidan. Oh, no. oh, oh, Naalala ko yun. Oh, siya. I have to go, I have to go. Sabi ko, okay lang ba siya? Sobrang na-affect. Pero na-realize ko now, na-affectohan ka kasi binabasa mo as Archie. Archie, yeah. And I told you that parang nagpipicture taking tayo last na sabi ko, hindi ko pa rin ma-process yeah. talaga. Hindi ko an overwhelmed pa rin ako. Then, Lalo na yung ending na mm-hmm. pinol yung ano mo, pinol, mm-hmm. like, oh, kahit madaming option yun, pero pinol yung life support mo. Pero as Archie, alam ko sa sarili ko, ikaw yung safe space ko, yeah. ikaw yung protector ko, and parang may pagkaano, alam kong gusto ko na, laging nandyan yung mommy ko. Yeah. Ang sama ng tingin mo sa akin nun. Yeah, super like, yeah. hindi ako makamukon nun. Tingisigawan niya pa ako nun. No, no, how dare you? How dare you? <laughs> Wait, is this the script reading pa lang? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Galit na ako sa akin <laughs> Paano pa kaya nung pinakita na si Louie talaga? Oh, pinakita, si Louie si si talaga si ako. Na ako Sinigaw mo niya na talaga ako. <laughs> no! Oh my God, no! <laughs> I love seeing this dynamic though. Kasi, syempre, magkakaiba tayo ng holding room or ng dressing room or seeing you three together. Together, hindi yun usually nangyayari kapag nasa taping tayo. Yeah. Either si Princess ang lagi kasama sa girls area, si Fofo dun sa mga older boys, and then the younger guys all have their own space. Yeah. So, I like seeing you guys together <laughs> na hindi nasa TikTok. Yeah. <laughs> hindi nasa TikTok tayo nagkakasama. So, and I think parang as a viewer, seeing this side of you is also so refreshing. Kasi mm-hmm. we all have seen Louis and and Archie sa Royal Blood. Kilala kayo as your characters. Yeah, I have a question, Bonizi. So, yun, andi talaga tayo na kapag usap at all, like mm-hmm. during the set. So, what I love about working is I get to talk to all, uh, at least I get to talk to the co actors. Mm-hmm. not obviously not everyone. But I like kasi asking questions about their characters, about what they think. So, now is my chance na tanungin kayo all the questions that I have. So, I'm just curious. Ani yung naisip nyo, or parang for you, what's a storyline of your character that you wish na explore palalo? 
in the story. So no, I'll give an example, okay? Or what was a part of your character that you really enjoyed and you wanted to enjoy a bit more or parang nagulat kayo when you started Royal Blood all the way until it ended. So I'll start. So um, Christoph Royales, lagging galit. Like literally, mm -hmm. if I had a thousand scenes in Royal Blood, 990 of those scenes, galit ako. Yeah. This ranges of rage. Rages of and rage. And sobrang... Natuwa ako doon. Napagod ako ng bongga. Pero natuwa ako because that was an emotion na hindi ko usually nagagawa. Usually, yeah. ako yung parang romantic or yung cheesy guy na, na, na laging na in love. Ako oh, kahit in love, galit na galit pa rin. Galit pero in love, <laughs> di ba? So, I really enjoyed that side of Christoph and exploring that. So, para sa akin, para naging adventure siya as an actor and as an artist. And the storyline naman that I wish I had was actually, I told, I told this to Lian, I told this to Rian, I wish I had more scenes with them. And I actually wish I had more scenes with you guys. Yeah. Because I don't think we had one scene together. At all. Zero! Oh my god! What did that happen? We have... My butt one time. Zero, no? Oh my god! The lonely people. Actually, we have a scene together. So you had scenes with James and Princess? But honestly, maybe less than five. Less than na parang kami lang talaga yung nag interact mm -hmm. One was nung binabuli niya si Archie, tapos nag-awi kami ni Margaret. Two, nung tinanong ko sila kung bakit may umiiyak. So going back to the question, um, I, I was really, I'm curious, ano yung mga storylines that you wish on a personal level you would have explored within your characters? And what else did you enjoy about that? So, you know. Let's start with James. Para sa akin, I would like to explore more yung relationship namin ni Beatrice. Mm. Okay. Yung sa last time, yung parang yeah. gusto niya akong amponin. Ay! Okay, Actually, tama. parang first scene lang din namin yun eh. Yung sa stairs? Mm -hmm. First scene niya together? First scene huh? namin yun. Wala akong ano dun. Interaction Grabe, din. No? Wala akong interaction. It's so interesting how big of a cast we are and we realize kung sino yung mga lagi natin nakaka-interact at hindi natin nakaka-interact. Okay. Wala, wala po talaga akong scene kay Beatrice nun. So, wala po talaga akong makuha nun sa kanya nun. Pero nakaka-intriga, no? Opo. Medyo, medyo nahirapan ako dun pero what was like yung naiisip ko nun was like big ate. Yeah. Parang siya na lang yung nandito para sa akin. Kasi ako yung pinakamatanda sa aming magkakapatid so wala talaga akong makuha nun. Yeah. yeah. So yun, parang I'm starting to think na big ate ko na lang siya na meron akong ate. Tapos siya yung parang may gusto mag-alaga sa akin even though we didn't have a good relationship. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Gee, so hey, interesting. That's interesting. I, I like that. Curious din ako, like what's the aftermath? Oh, what about you, princess? Um, siguro yung relationship namin ng totoo kong ate, si Sarah mm. Quendo. Tsaka, kasi naguluhan talaga ako noon. Kasi parang alam ni Beat, Alam, alam ni Bina, ate ko siya. Oo nga eh. Mm. So, so like... Okay. Ay, oo nga, no? Mm -mm. So, alam niya? Opo. Wait, sa so, scene. So, nasabi ba yun? Hindi. Ah, hindi kasi nung lumapit siya. Di ba sabi mo, naiganti kita ng hindi... Mm. Na hindi nadudumisan. Nad nadudumisan yung kamay. But B was in the room when you said that. Mm. Di ba? Tapos parang hindi siya, hindi siya, ano, nagulat na kapatid ko siya. So, parang, ang yeah. akin, alam na niya na kapatid ko si Sarah. Oh, baka nakalimutan ni Lian mag-react. <laughs> so yun na curious lang din ako kung like si Sana na explore pa more kung pa paano siya paano siya kinubkop ni B paano pa um how B felt nung ano nung nalaman niya na ate ko siya and ano and syempre yung relationship ko with Sarah kasi yung first scene ko lang din with Sarah is nung ano yung sinabi ko na hindi na dong nisan so Siyempre, hindi ko alam kung gano'n ka ano yung relationship namin na sisters. So, ayun, sana mas na-explore ka. And I'm curious to know kung, kung ano yung ano eh. Ano ba yung sinasabi niya na naiganti kita na hindi na dudumisan yung kamay? Like, what specific moment was that? Uh, kasi it could have been referred to so many different yeah. things. Kasi namin nangyari. And not just yeah. the accident. Hindi ko din po na-gets yun eh. Actually, yeah. I was asking her kung ano yung line Hanggang na yung Hanggang ngayon po, hindi ko din alam ko. <laughs> Hello, RJ? RJ, ano yung ano na to? Uh, okay, ipapanoorin ito ni RJ and then baka tumawag siya uh. sa'yo. <laughs> <laughs> Message siya sa'yo. Sa'yo, Aidan, ano yung sa'yo? Uh, sa akin siguro, sa... Sa mga cast, si Tito Andrew. Hindi ko nga alam kung tinatawag ko siyang Tito Andrew eh. Oh, nga, Pero wala akong sing with him. Talaga. Like kami lang. Usually, sa uh, birthday ko, di ba, parang madami tayo. Usually, ganun, yeah. puro group scenes. 
Then, ayun, parang wala pa akong sina tinawag siyang Tito Andrew. <laughs> hindi ko nga alam kung tatawag siyang Tito. So, I don't have any idea dun sa part na yun. Wait, do you call Margaret and... Tita Margaret, Tita Beatrice. Tita. Okay. Oh, Tita Beatrice, sino pa ba? So, for tito sure, Napoy. for sure, Tito Andrew. It's just sure, that yeah, yeah. you never said it. Yeah, yeah, never. Ngayon ko lang naisip, sabi ko, sino nga ba? Sabi, oh, nga no, Tito Andrew. <laughs> Then, syempre na-dead siya. Mm-hmm. Na wala na matay siya, wala na kami scene. Matay siya, wala kami scene na, na parang merong connection kami. Then, hindi ko alam kung paano magre-react si Archie kapag nalaman niyang wala na yung Tito yeah. Andrew niya. So, hindi ko, wala yun eh. Wala din sa script na, yeah. na if nabalitaan ko ba kung well, dead, yung wala na talaga siya. Kasi, tul- di ba ang bilis ng that week eh. Ang bilis, ang So, so um, parang right after that, doon na yung aksidente niya eh. Then, ay, ang daming nangyayari. So, I feel like, siguro yun, more on scenes or like, kung paano ako magre-react then kapag nalaman kong patay na si Vito Andrew. And ano ba, gano'ng kalalim yung relationship namin? Kasi may time din na, parang sinabi niya, binubuli niya ako na dapat, yeah. hindi ko na, huwag, huwag niya na akong patulan. Yeah. Kahit, pero si Tita Margaret, kinukonsinti siya. Pero yung dad niya, hindi siya kinukonsinti. So, parang curious ako kung, kung paano magiging relationship namin. Like, um, Sa, if may interaction, oh, yeah. if may interaction kami. Kung, pa, kung paano din siya, mag, kung paano niya din ako approach yeah. kung paano niya ako ititit. Kasi never ka niya na-approach. Yeah. Sobrang rich talaga ng royal blood, no? Yung yeah. experience natin, the yeah. story. Actually, I wanna jump off from experience. Kasi even for us, sobrang, sobrang ibang klase yung reception mm. sa show. And it's, you don't always get to feel this way kasi with a teleserye. Mm, so, Considering that this might be, is are these your biggest roles, ba, in a prime time show? First, kato eh. Yeah, this is your first. Okay, so sure. the, this is Me your. Me too. <laughs> so this is your first big prime time show, and it got so much attention. Attention. Yeah. It got mm. great, uh, great feedback. feedback from the audience. How do you feel since medyo may pagka newbies kayo mm. because you're all quite young? How does it feel to get that kind of attention? And when people see you on the streets ba, do they call you by your character mm. names? Like ano yung nakikita? Or ano yung napag-uusapan niyo ng mommy niyo kasi uh, lagi din kasama. Uh, I'm sure they're always watching. Yeah, so uh, let's start with Aidan first. Uh sa akin la laging Pag lumalabas ako, usually, laging tinatawag Archie. Where's then, my motorcycle? Yeah, where's my motorcycle? Parang nung sparkle spell lang. Oh, where's your motorcycle? Where's Tito Napoy? Where's your mommy Diana? Where's your daddy Christoph? So, wala. Nandun. Iniwan ako. Pinabayaan ako. Ganun. Puro ganun. Like, laging Archie na. Yes. Laging Archie na. Even sa social media, puro Archie sila. So, ako, ginagamit ko na din. Archie, natutuwa ko kasi nare-recognize ako as Archie din. Then, siguro nung nag-start pa lang, Uh, naglabas na din kasi ng article yung Jeme eh, about mm-hmm. my character then uh, ang dami ding articles from uh, sa ibang mga publisher so that time hindi pa talaga nagsisink in sa akin yeah. sabi ko ah okay sige baka it's part of the show lang kasi maingay talaga yung show and yung cast din kasi bigatin mga kasama namin cast then hanggang eventually like lalo na pag may mga special scenes ako na hindi ko alam nagtitrending daw siya sa TikTok TikTok and somehow parang sa <laughs> sa ano yeah sa, sa Twitter din nagte-trend yeah. daw like ang daming mga good feedbacks tinanong ako sa RJ ano daw na feel ko nung parang uh, party natin Royal mm. Blood party sabi ko uh, hindi ko honestly hindi ko alam kung da, ano dapat ko maramdaman pero that time kasi parang hindi talaga nagsi-sync in sa akin overwhelming overwhelming pa ako na like, oh, deserve ko ba to like kasi like parang it's too good to be true kasi first project yeah. ko then ganto agad so Natatakot ako, may pressure of course ngayong after na oh, what if sunod mag-fail ako or what, ganyan-ganyan. Pero like, I have, just, just have to remind myself na it's okay. Uh, and I feel like basta ga- gawin ko lagi yung best ko, then ayun, mabigyan ko ng justice yung uh, work ko. Then fun fact lang, hindi naman fun fact, pero isa sa mga goal ko din kasi nung making, uh, ginagawa ko yung character ko and uh, Royal Blood nagsisimula. I don't, tinanong kasi ko nung sa Spark, la, mm. ah yan, nung Sunday, kasi nagte-trending daw and nagpa-viral and stuff. Tapos, they asked me kung, like, kung paano ginawa yung mga scenes. Sabi ko, like, hindi ko talaga, while doing it, never kong pinlano and never 
pumasok sa isip ko na gagawin ko to para mag-trending or mag-viral yeah. ako. You just Wala. play art. Yeah, yeah. Parang ang goal ko lang nandi, nandito ko. Dahil aktor ako, ito yung trabaho ko, gawin ko yung trabaho kasi binabayaran ako dito. Yeah. <laughs> Parang ganun na. Basta ganun, like, gawin ko lang na maayos yung tra- trabaho ko as an actor. Yeah. At magbigyan ko ng justice yung uh, character ko and ayokong ma-disappoint sa akin yung management and yung mga boss na naglagay sa akin for this role. Then, bonus na lang yung nag trending pala siya, mm-hmm. naging viral. Then, eventually, pati yung mga boss, kinakongratulate ako na hindi ko, like, n- hindi ko inakala yeah. na ganun. And even mga writers, ang dami nang nakilala sa akin sa GMA. So, puro, kahit puro Archie, nat- nakakatawa. That's so, great. And, It's great mindset also though. Kasi, to know what Um, it really is hard to mm-hmm. jump from one success to another. Yeah. And I guess Royal Blood was very successful. Kasi lahat tayo jive eh. Mm-hmm. Lahat tayo hard workers like what you mentioned. Lahat tayo, we were focused on doing well and being yeah. good. And everyone on the set was nice from artists yeah, hanggang yeah. sa kahit anong production. production. Kahit sino man sa production. So, Lagi mo tatandaan yan, Aidan. Basta ikaw, always do a good job. Always be nice to the people around you. And whether or not it's a success, basta yeah. ikaw, alam mo sa sarili mo, nagawa mo yung kailangan mong gawin. Old person advice, I see. Yeah, Megan old na nga. <laughs> <laughs> ano ba? Di na Megan bata. Okay. Megan bata. The wisdom of the old. Okay, wisdom anyway, moving on, moving on. Uh, princess, princess. Um... Parang parehas lang eh, kasi diba sabi ni Aidan, pag lumalabas siya, nakikilala siya as Archie. Ako naman, so parang bigla na lang, nung naalala ko nung nag-mall kami ng mga pinsan ko. Ta- tapos may nagsabi, uy, si Anne yan, diba? Siya ba yung killer? Killer! <laughs> <laughs> sabi ko, ha? Paano ko na? Eh, yung mga times na yun, hindi pa napakita na, like, inista ko si Napoy, ah, gano'n, gano'n. Mm. Tapos may mga nagpapapicture, diba? Ikaw yung killer, diba? <laughs> Tapos, pag may nagpapapicture na si Ann, naiinis ako kasi bigla na lang nawawala yung family ko. Uh, pati yung mga pinsan ko na kasi sobrang introverted nila. Sabi ko, wala ka dyan, pag may nagpapicture pa sa'yo, iiwan ka na talaga na. <laughs> <laughs> kasi parang hindi ko alam kung nahihiya sila uh-oh, or ano. So ako, ako naman, um, aside from that, syempre natutuwa ako kasi um, may, madami na din akong shows na nagawa. Pero ito talaga yung um, pinaka-successful. At nakilala talaga ako and eh ko ba pero like sobrang ano sobrang saya sa pakiramdam pati nga yung mga teacher ko sa ISO so, sabi pati mo baka may pa video greet kay Megan siya kay na ano <laughs> <laughs> sabi mo bigyan mo muna ako ng ano <laughs> ng plus <laughs> bonus bonus, bonus. bonus. pero um uh, uh, yun nga sobrang bait ng mga cast pati mga production Pagkatas ko kasi mag, ano, mag Royal Blood, may mga ginawa na din akong mga uh, shows. Sobrang iba niya sa mm. production ng Royal Iba yeah, yung taping yeah. set natin. Iba, oh, iba. Sobra. So, ayan. Um, very grateful lang na um, isa sa mga big, big projects ko. Tapos mga nakasama ko is very, ano, mabait and very magaan lang. Mm. That's me. <laughs> no, kidding. Hindi <laughs> <laughs> nga kami <laughs> nagsama eh. Hindi <laughs> <laughs> nga kami nagsama sa ganyan. <laughs> no, ang ganda kasi talaga ng vibe natin lahat eh. Pag nasa set, yung parang people were just genuinely curious mm-hmm. about each other. So, walang ilangan, and it was easier na mas makilala natin yung isa't isa. So, James, ano naman sa'yo? Anong pakiramdam after all the success of Actually, Ryan Blood? Overall po, nakaka-overwhelm, tsaka ang saya din. Not only sa attention po ng fans, pero sa family ko din po, especially mga family members ko, yung lola ko, pag tinguwi ko ng bahay, <laughs> napanood kita kanina, gumagalan yung lola ko. Tapos, Dinuduro ka pa eh, no? no? <laughs> Ayun, there was this one time po na nagpa-hospital ako kasi I got sick. Oh, shucks. During Royal Blood? During Royal Blood po, I got sick. Oh my gosh. Tapos, Um, di ba nagpa-check up po ako? Ang sabi ng doktor, ikaw ba si Louis sa Royal Blood? Pagkatapos po nun lahat po sila nagpapapicture na sa akin. Nakalimutan. Na may sakit ka! Opo, nakalimutan. <laughs> nakalimutan na po nila akong i-check up. Ay, hello! <laughs> What the norm? Alam mo na next time, dapat sabihin mo, bago kayo magpa-picture, asikasuhin nyo naman muna ako. <laughs> Pagalingin nyo muna. Pagalingin nyo muna ako sa kanina. Nauna po yung mga pictures, tsaka yung mga nagpapavideo mm. grade pa po yung mga nurse <laughs> doon. So, sa akin naman po okay lang naman po yun pero unahin naman sa ni Hel. No, baka naman pwede niyo i-cure muna yung sickness de, niya. De, selfie with Louie muna. <laughs> yun po, uh, nakaka-overwhelm po siya. 
Okay. Well, yeah, that's that's okay. valid naman, valid naman yeah. coming from you guys. All right, you know what? We've talked about Royal Blood a lot. Yeah. Ready? I guess before we wrap up the royal blood portion, quick hitters lang. Okay, so quick answers lang. I want you to answer also. Oh, okay. Off the top of your head, what were your favorite scene? What was your favorite scene? Personal Ooh. level or as an actor? <laughs> baka na satisfy kayo or baka na gusto yung register nyo, baka kala nyo pogi kayo, maganda kayo dun sa TV nung lumabas. It could be whatever it is. Just uh, let us know. Let's start with Bonizi. Okay. At the top of my head, my favorite scene is when Diana is taking off all mm-hmm. her makeup after siyang anuhin ni Christophe. Tapos umiiyak na ako noon, biglang nakita ko si Archie. Tapos nagyakapan kami ni Archie na parang, anak, I'll be here for you. Tapos grabe, as in, na- yeah, yeah, yeah. yung parang nag-jive lang yung yeah. emotions natin. And we really, I felt in that moment that I was really your mother. And I really felt that you were my son. And parang I was there to protect you. Naiyak nga ako ngayon. Oh. Eh, mo na, hindi, parang nafe-feel ko yung, uh, yung vibe na, Diana, I'm here to protect Archie. No matter what happens, ayoko malaman niya na ako yung may gumawa nito kay mm. Gustavo. Basta, I'm here to protect him no matter what. Mm. And sobrang nadala ko dun sa eksena. That was probably one of my most favorite scenes of Royal Blood. Okay, para may iba naman. Princess. Uh, um, uh, Straight answer na yung tinanggal ko yung hoodie. Mm. Yun talaga. Ah, Kasi, um, outro royal blood. Dahil ang ganda mo doon. Tapos na mo. Tapos na mo siya. Pero kasi, syempre si Anne, kasi parang like, ano siya eh, outro royal blood, parang ano siya, sweet, marites, yeah. ganun ganun. Pero yung, to see that side of Anne, na parang, may pagka-dark, mm-hmm. parang sobrang cool. Tapos lalo na napanood ko siya first time dun sa TV, yeah. nung nag-Christmas na, sabi ko, ah, oh, maganda ko ito. Ano yun? Ano yun? Ano yun? Ano yun? Wait, one take lang ba yun? One take lang? Okay. Oh. Ang dami, sobrang dami. Kasi extended. Oh, extended yun. Extended kasi one camera. So, sinimot ka ng extended. Oh. <laughs> okay. Okay. okay, okay, James. Uh, aside po dun sa binunod ko yung saksakan mo, <laughs> uh, yung sa akin talaga, Uh, yung kay Kuya Dion, mm. yung sa dad ko, yung kinakausap ko siya sa presinto, yung inaaway ko na siya. Okay. Kasi yeah. akala ko siya talaga yung pumatay kay Gustavo. Uh, and, every time I, and every time I think about it, lagi akong napapaiyak. Okay. Kasi sa Royal Blood po talaga, ang iniisip ko na po talaga sa tatay ko si Kuya Dion. Yeah. Mm. Siya lagi ko nakakausap doon. Yeah. Eh. Siya yung lagi ko nakakausap tapos to think na may scene kami na ganun, na iiwan ako siya tapos mababaril lang din siya yeah. sa dulo. Okay, um, next is Ada. Ada. Uh, I mean, uh, my, one of my faves, I think yung, ang dami ko yung favorite na scene mm-hmm. eh, and yung mga mahirap eh. Salam. Salam. Ah, shucks. Siguro, yung scene, last scene ko with you. Which with one? mom. May nasa hospital. Ah, and then, hindi naman hospital. Guest room ng yeah. Basta house. parang naka-correct na ako dun sa... Yeah, yung kasama uh, sila? Yeah, ah, uh, yeah. And, and Lizzie. Uh, Lizzie. And Lizzie. Kasi that time, I remember second to the last taping natin yun yeah. sa Laguna. Then, parang I was preparing pa nun before yung scene natin. Mm-hmm. Nag-prep-prep na talaga ako. Then, ako, my, go- my goal lang that time is to feel yung longing na hindi di na kita um, nakakausap or what. Yung parang miss na miss lang kita. Then eventually, while doing it, nag-appear bigla yung may, merong fear of abandonment. Yeah. Ayokong, uh, ayokong maiwan, ayokong magayak. Biglang nag, nag kasi yung mga sinabi ko doon, ang daming adlib din eh. Wala yeah. talagang sa script eh. Pero parang that time, bala ko din talagang like merong ganung factor. Pero at the same time, uh, respect din sa writers. Ayoko masyadong madaming adlib. So inontian ko lang, gusto ko na doon pa rin yung thought. Then puro emotion na lang nandoon sa emotion ko uh, idadaan. Then that time while doing it, inaavoid ko yung fear of abandonment. Ayoko siya lumabas. Gusto ko maging parang mothership na emotion ko, yeah. ang obligation ko, emotional obligation ko for the scene, yung longing na miss na miss ko na yung mom ko, then, bigla na lang while doing it, merong biglang sumulpot na fear of abandonment, kaya siguro nasabi ko din na don't sleep tight like Lolo. Yeah, oh, you know, I almost cried. Yeah. Nakapikit na ako noon, sabi ko, parang napalunok talaga ako. Bas ako. Nalagin. Joke lang. And then, napil ko talaga yung... Mm, and parang, di ba, nabigla ako nasabi na I miss your voice, Actually, ang dami ko pang, ang daming nag-flashback na memories ko with you. Yeah. Yung uh, naggawa tayo ng milkshake, yeah. yung milkshake natin, ang pizza night. Ang dami, like, uh, you helping me cleaning my toys. And for me, as Archie, 
that time na to flashback siya while doing the scene for me totoo siyang nangyari yeah. sa, as Archie yeah. hindi siya like for di ba kasi kung sometimes pwede mong isipin na no it's just a scene sa yeah. sa Royal Blood or sa sa soap na ginagawa ni teleserye pero for me memory siya ni Archie yes. totoo siya kaya nagulat ako that time kaya one of my favorite yun kasi for Archie totoong totoo yung scenes na yun I mean hindi hindi ko siya tinatawag na scene eh. Mas tinatawag siya memories ni Archie eh. So, so parang for me, like, what? Kaya palang magawa. Kasi na-surprise ako na that na-reach ko yung, yung, oh, lumabas yung emotions na yun. And nag-flashback siya na hindi ko, uh, hindi ko iniisip na it's just um, parang ginawa lang namin yeah. kung sino to. It's memories talaga siya ni Archie. And you know what's funny is, tinanong kami ni RJ, kung um, ma-acting ba kayo, nafe-feel nyo ba na may camera? Minsan nasabi ko na, minsan hindi. Mm. Minsan feeling ko talaga na nandun ako sa eksena. And also because yung mga shots din ni Direk, minsan nasa likod mo yung camera, din yeah, mo yeah. nakikita. So parang feeling mo talaga, it really feels like it's happening. Yeah, yeah. Parang yung nakafocus ka lang po sa kasin mo. Yes. So, na, wow, parang nag-blur out yung mga yeah. nasa gilid. Yung mga lights, yung mga tao. Parang yeah, yeah, feeling yeah. mo kayo lang talaga. O ikaw, anong favorite scene mo? Fofo? Oh, okay. first thing that comes to mind, that darn horse, yung sa last time. Yeah. <laughs> so, okay. Favorite, favorite scene. Favorite scene. Kasi feeling ko ang laking challenge ng lang yung kabayo na yan eh. Kinakagat True. Kayo. Kinakagat ako ng kabayo. <laughs> Naabot so, siya. The, the head of the horse, the horses in the, in the location were huge, di ba? Mm. Sobrang laki nila. Yeah, yeah. So their mouths were like this big. <laughs> They were nibbling on my arm. Yeah. And then supposedly stoic ako. Wala masyadong, wala masyadong emosyon na pinapakita. Sad lang. Biglang bumaganan yung kabayo tapos yung laway. <laughs> Malapot yung laway niya. Tapos tatanggalin niya, kita mo yung linya ng laway. Sabi ko, walang iyong kabayo. <laughs> Maarte kami dito. Huling excited na namin. Tapos kailangan lumiyak ka, di ba? I mean, I, I wasn't really planning. I mean, but whatever he came, whatever he came. Basta so, I knew what the emotion was. Naiyak ka ba dun but sa kabayo? But that darn... Oh, and then talaga kailangan kang gawin ng paraan kasi yung kabay lumalapit tapos lumalapit na sinapoy. Eh. Yeah, yeah. So, kaya ako ginanon. Mm. Actually, there's a scene na sabi, ay, wow, sweet naman ni, ano, ni, uh, ano pa nga na ito, Christoph. Ginanon ba yung kabayo? Ginanon ko yung kabayo para lumayo siya. <laughs> and I remember kasi that scene, the ba kailan iabot ko yung kamay mo? Tapos, umiiwas siya. Yeah. Then, yeah, 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 yeah. Ang tagal natin yeah, yeah. It's okay, Mr. G. It's okay. Puro ganun lang kami. As ang tagal niyang ginagawa hanggang sa eventually, lumingon na siya. Paglingon naman niya, kinaka, kinakagat na <laughs> Kinakagat yung kamay ni Christoph. Oh, but anyway, so that was mine. Uh, that was mine. But I think that kind of closes our royal blood yeah. section. Yeah. I want to know our guests a little bit more. I didn't get the chance to know you guys during the set. Di tayo nag-uusap. But, but I must say, uh, there are a couple of things I did pick up. But before that, another quick hitter. Okay. Quick okay, hitter. another quick hitter just so that I guess the audience gets to know you guys as well. So quick answers. How old are you guys? 17. 15. 18. Okay. <laughs> Don't worry, we're cutting that out. <laughs> I'm 35. I, I don't I don't remember my age to be honest. Twenty three. Okay, okay. Uh, you are old looking twenty three year old. Okay, okay. 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 But sa royal blood, ako'y pinabata sa amin. Oh my god. Oh, oh, I didn't know. Twelve ako, tapos ang turn ako na thirteen. Yeah. Oh, you were twelve? Twelve blood? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Kaya nga sabi ko, ang laki naman ng anak. Yeah, Christoph, 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 Christoph kasi hindi ko alam yung age ng anak ko. Nahihirapan ako nun kasi isipin ko na bata siya, pero yeah. magkaibigan kami in real life eh. So, how old were you in Royal Blood? How old was uh, Louis? Uh, my actual so age, 16. Yeah, 16. What? Si Anne? 15? Halos same lang din. Okay. Uh, so, okay. like, nung nag-audition, I told Miss Reg na never nag-consider nga dun sa role ng... Uh, ng Archie kasi na 12, then yeah. at 18, ako, I was aiming for for his character. Oh yeah, we didn't talk about it because mm. when they auditioned, Louis auditioned yeah, for Ar- Archie. Ay, James auditioned for Archie and Aiden auditioned for Louis. Louis. But okay. nabalik tag siya. Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. So, okay, okay. Oh, wait, moving on, moving on. Okay, moving more on. quick more quick hitters. Okay, I'm curious. Obviously, hindi ka pure Filipino. Ano lahi mo? American po. American and? Filipino. Ah, okay, filam. Filam? Filam. Uy. <laughs> um, um, ano ba? Half chimpanzee, half Filipino. 
Okay, game same tayo. Okay. Um, hot food. Uh, uh noy pee. Noy pee. Pure, pure, pure. Pure, pure. Uh, pure. Uh, I'm pure. Parang di naman malit naman parang na iba yung cura mo sa amin. <laughs> Super pure, di ba your Lola Spanish? Uh, no, no, I'm just saying. But I, I, I was just curious. I was just curious because, siempre James obviously looks yeah. like he has foreign blood. Yeah. So it's always nice. I mean, me, me, na siguro like mga older, like mga grand, great grand. Ah, okay, okay. Pero okay. like to me, malana, pure na, hundred percent. Pinoy na, na pinoy ang puso. Okay, yeah. all right. Well, I just wanted to know those things. Those are things I would normally ask anyway because I'm naturally curious. Yeah. But I did pick some cert, a uh, couple of things about you guys during our time in Royal Ooh. Blood. So for James, I know that he's a huge gamer. I see it in TikTok. Hey. You're the one with a huge setup, right? Yeah. On your table? Okay, so James is a gamer. See, si Princess Naman, one thing I did pick up about her, I want to talk to you about this later on, but my natural vlogging instincts though. Hindi. Comediante to. And then, then comediante rin. Comediante. Natural hosting instincts. I think I told you this. I said, okay, magkakaroon ka ba ng YouTube channel? Yeah, Kasi yeah. aabangan ko yan. I'm going to like and subscribe. Yeah. <laughs> like. And then, and then si Aidan, another thing that I picked up kasi nakakasama ko siya, sobrang usin ito. Sabi na ako. Sobra. Sabi na ako. So, so, he's, no, he's, he's very particular. You can do a YouTube or IG montage when he's going to pitch before he's packed up. Because the story of his story, the story of his story, the story of his story, so it's like a carry-on or a medium-sized yeah, luggage. Yeah. Yeah. But when you're in the middle, you partition all the way. You know where you're going. The t-shirt, the malinis na brief, the maduming brief, the toiletries, the food, the food, the snacks. So I'm just happy because I noticed these quirks yeah. about you guys. And you then... are so organized. Now, to the point that I actually sat down and I watched you. <laughs> really? Uh, yeah. I, I, I was like sitting down. I didn't have any excess. I was just waiting. So I said, why are you? So yeah, so pinanood kita habang nagpapakap ka ng gamit. Sabi ko, so organized niya. I love it. ASMR. Yeah. yeah. Actually, para ayun yung um, na-relate ko kay Archie. Kasi ah, Archie, may pagkaan siya. Or, or, I mean, usually sa mga uh, within the spectrum, yeah. diba? Meron sila usually routine. Yes. So ayun yung para na, mas na-relate ko dun. Kaya mas nakuha ko din yung Archie. And it's part of my routine din para mas maging in character ako. I love it. Gin ginamit ko na din siya. All right, so Aiden was able to expand on that. I'm curious, um, Princess Namuna, what do you think about that? Okay, so you did that hosting thing, and I noticed you have this natural instincts for hosting and vlogging, and I guess creating content. Ano yung nararamdaman mo dun? Or is that something that you already do? Tell me something about that. Um, actually, ever since I was a kid, palagi na ako nagbablog. Sa oh, sa sa okay. cellphone ginagamit ko yung may may camera kasi kami parang ganyan pero malit lang. Okay. Tapos, like, parang ako mag-vlog doon, ganyan-ganyan. Tapos, parang ano, parang masaya sa pakiramdam eh. Pero actually, nung nag-vlog ako, tapos in-interview po kita, natitense talaga ako noon. <laughs> kasi, um, masaya siya kapag mag-isa ka lang, tapos wala kang ano. Yes. Pero kasi, si ano, nag-vlog kami, parang ako yung gumagawa ng mga questions ko. So, parang natitense ako. Parang mas gusto ko ako lang mag-isa. <laughs> <laughs> tapos, um, parang first time po ba yun? Or like? With Mads? Yeah, that was our first interaction. Interaction mo. Uh, so, so, At sobrang dadana niya, ha? <laughs> Gusto ko nga makita yung footage niya. Inakit ba niya? Inupload ba ni Mads? I want to see that. But you're good. Pero naramdaman kayo intention. Pero intention lumabas in a nice way. Sobrang daldal mo lang. Sabi ko, ay, okay, okay to, ha? Chill lang ako dito. Pero nag-iisip lang ako na nga ng sarili. Pero ano, sa ano sa bahay kasi namin, parang bukod sa dad ko, ako lang din yung ano, nagpapasir sa kanila. Wow! <laughs> Kasi siya ngayon komedyante. I, I, I always told you this before, na nung nahanap yung TikTok mo, Princess, sobrang uh, endless scrolling yung nangyari. I was just video after video after video. Sabi ko, sobrang nakakatawa tong babaeng. Oh, like, do you even know na meron kang, uh, what do you call that, yung comedic um, timing. timing? Do you know that you have this? Um, I... Oh, po. 
Oo, oh, oh, siya nga yung parang ano nga, siya yung makulit sa pamilya. Yeah, so, Pero buti alam mo, okay. At yun. least you know, para, I mean, it's an advantage for And ma-explore mo yan. Oo, oh, oh, so sana ma-explore mo rin yung comedy kasi I know na magaling ka sa drama dahil pag nakikita natin si Anno, umiiyak sa Royal Blood, napangaling! Pero yung comedic timing mo, on point. So I hope ma-explore mo rin yung comedy. Oh, Sparkle, alam nyo na, <laughs> kayo nyo na, ilagay nyo sa bubble gang paminsan-minsan. <laughs> And then, oh, moving on to James, naman. As a gamer, oh, tell us something about. Ganong, how much of a gamer are you? Uh, actually, one hundred percent. Wow! Yeah! wow. <laughs> Represent. Pag pagmula ako magago, maglalaro lang talaga ako. Valorant, ML, hey. Overwatch, Roblox. Wow, lahat talaga. Opo. Ano yung game na, na nag-start para sa yung? Na nag-start talaga ako. Temple Run? Wow! Oh my god! Oh my god. So, so, so you, Super Mario, Super Mario namin, because that's where I started. Yeah. Super Mario ever since, Ever since I was uh, uh, five, Temple yeah. Run, Subway Surfers. Yun, tos, On the phone, no? Opo. That was very first online game ko was uh, Roblox. Okay. That was naging ML, naging Minecraft, naging Valorant to Overwatch. Tos naging bari lang na. Oh, okay. first person. Ang galing, kasi parang, wala lang, parang I feel like gaming, I mean, especially for us, since we're also gamers, it's definitely an outlet outside of work na parang, yeah. oh, I'm just gonna like zone out, tapos yeah. dito lang yung mundo ko. Ganun din ba para sa'yo? Opo, kasi parang iba yung kaibigan ko sa games, iba yung kaibigan ko sa real life. Yeah. So, may ka-interact ako na may nakakasundo ako doon. May yes. nakakasundo din ako dito. Mm. Parang ganun po. Na- mo ba mag-stream ever? Nag-stream na po ako before ng ML. Talaga? Okay. On Facebook? Yeah. Or Twitch? Facebook Live po. Uh, did you enjoy it? May bala ka bang uh, bumalik, bumalik uh, sa streaming? Ano yung uh, thoughts mo doon? Nagbabalak na ako mag-stream ulit eh, kasi I really love playing games. Oh, oh sayang. Oh, kasi, sayang like, okay, what's a normal gaming session for you? Ilang hours yun? Be honest! <laughs> Kahit nandiyan si Mami! A whole day. Whole day. Oh, mm-hmm. Sayang yun. Whole Stream day, mo na yun. Whole day to 3 a.m. ng madaling ako. Oh, alam mo na. Be useful with your time. Mm-hmm. Stream mo na yan. Stream, pa Stream pa mo na. na. Oo, oh, lalo na maraming fans si Louie. Oo, oh, mm-hmm. dami. Pwedeng pwede. Aabang, aabangan namin yan. Pag nag-stream ka. <laughs> share, share na yan. Oo, oh, anyway. So, okay. I guess we're talking about hobbies a little bit yeah. more. So, I'm curious. Let's go back to Princess. Dun sa TikTok. So, obviously, Bonizi loves your TikTok. Ano ba yung touring mo sa TikTok? Enjoy mo lang ba? Or minsan parang nagahanap ka talaga ng trendy videos to copy? Ano, may strategy ka ba? Obviously, you're still very young. 15, tama? Mm-hmm. 15 years old. So, curious ako, as a 15-year-old, but being in showbiz, ano yung atake mo sa TikTok? Wala lang? Or may plano? Or strategic? Ano? Um, ako po kasi dati, ayoko talaga ng TikTok. I don't I don't like it. Tapos yung thought of creating content sa TikTok parang hakatamad. Parang oh, ma an ma ano mag mag-watch pero like yung gumawa ka parang atas mag-iisip ka ng content. Pero like mga may mga napapanood kasi ako sa TikTok, may like mga comedy and mm-hmm. ano tapos eh may mga iba gusto kong i-try. Yes. Tapos parang iniisip ko as a um as a viewer din. Parang yung impact kasi sa akin yung mga comedy videos na nakikita ko dun, parang ano talaga nakaka-light, parang kunyari pagod ako, tapos makikita ko yun, parang sarap sa pakiramdam. So sabi ko, why not na itry kong gumawa ng content. Yes. Yung first content ko ata na ano, yung kaming dalawa, yung lumutang ako, yung vex. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> tapos, <laughs> parang sabi ko, ay, ang saya pala. Pero, pero ayoko yung mga like, mga lipsing lipsing gusto ko yung comedy. Yes, napansin ko rin. Uh, napansin so, ko din. Ayun, tapos hanggang sa nagbabayal na yung mga video sa amin, so, sabi ko, sige, tinuloy ka na lang. para kasi nung nagbabayal yun, parang hindi na nakakalaman. Yeah. <laughs> Oo, oh, syempre, may motivation. Yun yung naging motivation, di ba? Magpakatotoo na tayo. May uh, ano po, kasi lagi ko po siyang kasama sa TikToks, yes. di ba? Oh. Nagko-comedy videos kami. Ang napansin ko kay Princess, she acts out of free will. Hindi hindi niya po sinasadya yung pag-act niya po kung ano lang po yung lalabas. Yan yeah, uh, na feel niya. Yung, very organic yung, siya. Kaya nakakatawa po talaga. Ayun kasi nang scripted eh kasi yeah. parang ano na masyado. Pag magti-TikTok kami tapos parang it turns out to be scripted, hindi na namin itutuloy. Ah, mm. drafts forever. Kaso marami na kayong tapon. Marami na po. Dami na. So dapat pala may TikTok tapon account kayo. Natutuloy 
po kami sinasabihan James may mga, may mga comedy ka ba na TikTok diyan pa pa share naman para magkaroon siya ng content ganun Favorite ko yung ano yung mga TikTok niyo lalo na yung kayong tatlo yung mga Kalapan. bata Yung mga bata na <laughs> so cute super cute I love it Okay wait so I'm curious I'm curious now I want to touch I want to follow up on that So TikTok is your main social media account yes. you'd say do you have a Twitter Facebook and Instagram Facebook and Instagram, pero hindi sila ako mag-post na sa TikTok talaga. Okay, Twitter. Okay, so, bakit? Curious lang ako. Parang, ano yung naiisip mo? All of, obviously, you have other people who post on all social media accounts. That's us. So, I'm curious, para sa'yo, how do you see Facebook? How do you see Instagram? Obviously, Twitter wala. Ano yung thoughts mo sa Twitter? Patayin na ba yun or whatever? <laughs> so, uh, sa Instagram kasi, parang... Pupost na ako ng mga like outfits ko, ganyan-ganyan. Mm-hmm. Tapos parang post-post lang. Ewan ko, hindi ko din alam. <laughs> parang medyo boring Instagram sa akin. Gets. Gets. Yes, Pwede. yes. Pag sa Facebook naman, talaga ako nag-Facebook. Pag mag-post mm-hmm. ako siguro si Mami. Yes. <laughs> Ay, post mo yung Facebook. Thanks, Ay, Mami. Ay, post mo yung photo na yun sa Facebook. Pang-tanders na yung Facebook. Ano ko nga po, hindi ko alam kung paano mag-post sa Facebook. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait, I'm sorry. You don't know how to post on Facebook. That's <laughs> what I mean. What is it? 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 So, iwas yun rin, yun rin. Saka yun ka doon. Ako nag-twitter ako for the drama lang. <laughs> Ang daming drama oh. sa Twitter. Kung ano man yung trending, titingnan mo. Mm. Are you the same on the same boat? So, pag uh, every TikTok, Instagram, pang forma lang, and then uh, Facebook, Twitter, wala eh. Yung Facebook, para sa, para sa view ko kasi parang pang boomers. Yun. Gotcha! Okay. Kasi halos lahat ng mga lola ko nandun. <laughs> Ikaw na pa nung kita sa Royal Blood. I love this love so much. Spot. This is so good. This is gold. Pag sasabi ng mom ko, pag sasabi ng mom ko, kailangan mo na mag-post sa sabi ko sa mom ko. Mommy, pwede ba ikaw na lang mag-post sa Facebook? Tapos makikita ko pa po yung caption sa post ko, when you be kind to others, they will be <laughs> My quote. My quote. My quote, mommy, for you. <laughs> Basag si Mami! Kaya sabi ko, Mami, kung gusto mo mag-post sa mga accounts ko sa Facebook na lang. Tapos yung picture niya dun, seryosa! <laughs> si Mami kasi... Motivational ka pala sa Facebook. <laughs> Motivational coach ka. Ano lang po picture ko na mahanap niya, yun lang po ipip- yung ipopost niya sa Facebook. Alam Kaya sabi, sabi ko, Mom, sa Facebook ka na lang, ako nabala sa iba. Dapat ano, nagsisend ka weekly, o oh, ito, five pictures pang Facebook, tapos emoji na lang yung caption mo, ha? Oh, sabi ko nga po, so Mami, pwede ba pag magpo-post ka, Papakita mo muna sa akin yung picture ko, tsaka kung ano yung caption mo. Oh my god, that's so funny. Walang approval kay Jay. That's so funny. I love it, I love it. Okay, that was a, that was a great story. Okay, okay. Oh, next naman, next naman. Aidan, Aidan. Ano yung thoughts mo? About social media. Uh, um, siguro more active ako sa uh, IG and TikTok. Pero, try, tinatry ko din mag- Baka sa Facebook sa active, nahihiya ka lang. <laughs> Baka, <laughs> but now, tinatry ko mas maging active sa Facebook uh, to put more content. Kasi, mas nandun yung, ano eh, uh, mas, like, technically, di ba, mas uh, madaming tao sa uh, TikTok and and Facebook. Facebook. Is, parang iba-iba sila ng, uh, ng market. True. Then, Mm-mm. I don't have Twitter because, parang same din sa kanya, parang ayoko mo na ma-expose sa Parang, re- sa sad vibe na gano'n. Yeah, yeah. Sad doon. And I feel like I'm not ready for that. Mm-hmm. And I feel like wala din ako iti-tweet. <laughs> yeah. Gets naman. <laughs> Parang wala, hindi ako gano'n na so, tao na. So, shopping mo yung mami ni James. Doon ay mag-usap sa Twitter. Tapos <laughs> <laughs> puro mo ano, motivational quotes. <laughs> <search. laughs> Mag-search ka ng motivational quotes sa Google, uh, copy-paste mo. Tapos puro, puro doon puro yung, yung ano, motivational quotes. So, ayun na. Mm-hmm. Feeling ko wala din talaga akong ilalagay sa Twitter. Kaya more active ako ngayon sa uh, Instagram. Uh, TikTok and Threads Facebook. na lang daw. Threads. Wala pa ang threads eh. Wala, wala, wala din ako. Ikaw? Wala, 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 wala din kayo nila. Parang Twitter daw yun eh. Oh. Parang Twitter. Parang Twitter. So, parang Twitter. Parang daming rants dun eh. Ah, talaga? Sa thread. Mga 14 weeks ko na hindi nabubuksan yung threads. <laughs> this is so interesting. I love this. 
a different ano a different perspective definitely from us on social media yeah uh, we can talk about it more later on forget that yeah time. and i'm curious parang later we'll turn the tables around naman and then if you have any questions mm. that since we were never able to talk about right? any question under the sun just think about it bangko nyo lang yan we'll give the floor to you guys kayo naman yung host mamaya you can ask us anything you you, you want to ask but before we proceed, you have questions. I have a couple more. No, I don't have yet. Oh, okay. Um, so me, I, like I said, this is still my time and my chance to get to know you guys. I'm curious. I want to give you guys a situation, okay? So tama naman. Yaka tapos lang ng project natin. Let's say nakaipo na kayo, okay? And then you have, let's say, three to four weeks ahead if you will kung gago. Sabi ng sparkle, mm-hmm. okay, you're free to do whatever you want. You have money to spend. What are you going to do? Or, I know. <laughs> so what are you going to do? And then aside aside from that, another quick hitter lang. What are you going to buy? Like the first thing you buy, let's say para minigan ka na. <laughs> so curious ako, di ba? I mean, di ba? I mean, these are things you would naturally end up talking yeah. about. Yeah, so example yeah. lang, I'll start, di ba? So with uh, with Dion, si nakakasama ko siya lagi. And I don't know if you know, my very first talisere in uh, GMA, GMA, kasama ko si Dion. And then the next time na nakasama ko siya, was here na in Royal Blood. So 13 years later. So for me, very nostalgic seeing him. And parang yung pinaku dun. So parang bait kat talaga ni Dio. So parang bait. So when I saw him, it's like we never. It's like we, we. It's like we jumped off where we left off. Na parang right after Amaya, Royal Blood. It's like walang pagita na 13 years. Close kami ulit. Happy Mm-mm. happy. Good vibes. And dami yan ako nito. So sample what he bought. He bought like a smartwatch, yung Apple Watch Ultra yata. And he's like, oh, oh, Mick, deserve ko naman, di ba? Ganun siya. Hindi, alam mo na. Ganun naman siya. Ginagaslight niya yung sarili. Oo, naisip ko, di ba? Taping tayo, napapagod tayo. Para ma-happy naman ako. Ganyan, ganyan. Actually, ang ganyan. Ganyan, ganyan. Actually, minsan, napapagod. Ginagaslight niya na lang yung sarili niya na, ano, na wounded pa binili niya pa. Hindi siya magsisipin. Ang sin mo rin, ginagaslight. Yung tatay mo, nagagaslight ng sarili niya. Hindi, pero yan, pero supportahan naman natin. So anyway, Going back to my question, okay, so let's say you guys had the time, you guys had the money, what would you do, and what would you buy? Mm-hmm. Who will start? Ako na. Go. Actually, personally, medyo kuripot ako na tao. Okay, okay. okay. Um, ako magsispend lang kung kailangan na kailangan ko talaga, pero you can never go wrong with food. Ooh. Food trip talaga ako. Sa, mag-order ako sa Grab, anything, basta may pera ako. Hindi ko iniisip kung mauubos ang pera ko, basta makakabili ako ng paggain. Parang, so saan mo kami dadalhin kung ari? Parang, parang nung time na ano, nabili siya ng, lang, fr- ng fries, ng fries na ganyan ka dami. <laughs> Sobrang dami, tapos siya lang yung kumain nun. Nag-offer naman siya, pero syempre, he, he ordered that for yeah. himself. So saan tayo kakain kung mga lilibre ka at gusto mo masaya kaming lahat? Where would you take us? <laughs> Actually, I have this very, ano, yung favorite ko, yung K-Mall. Saan yan? Para magluluto ka ng noodles near GMA. Near GMA. Oh, It's a ah, weird convenience yeah. store. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Marami siya, different kinds of noodles as may toppings, then as magpapakulo ka. Lagi, lagi kami magkasama ni Princess. Oh okay, God. so sige, yung next ano natin, yung next YouTube video natin, doon tayo. Doon tayo. G! 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 Oh, I know! I'm Let's go! Okay, so that's what you're going to uh, do. What you, uh, no, that's what you're gonna buy. What are you gonna do? Uh, you have three traveling. to four weeks. Okay, I'll go. Where would you travel to? Boracay. Oh. Why? Bakit, bakit? Bakit Boracay? Mahilig talaga ako sa dagat eh. Okay, okay. Actually, nung nagpunta kami ng Boracay, um, talagang ayoko nang umalis. Okay. Parang iiyak na ako pag aalis na kami. Ayaw ko talagang umalis. Kasi pag, nakas- pag nakaupo lang ako sa dagat, parang napaka-calm. Yun lang yung gusto Peaceful. ko. Tara, Boracay na tayo. <laughs> I love Boracay also. Baka galing lang nila sa Boracay eh. Uh, right after Royal Blood, di ba? Yeah. Nag-beach kayo. Saya, saya. Pag end sila, ang vacation sila. Tagal na natin din ang buburo. Okay, okay. Come, let's go to Boracay daw ba? Okay, anyway, next, next, next. Uh, si princess, princess, princess. Um, siguro ako traveling din, pero gusto ko talaga makapunta sa Japan. Yes. Kasi um, big anime lover talaga ako. Fan talaga. Oh. So, so kung oh my gosh, gusto ko puma- ay bumili doon mga merch, yung mga Go ano. <laughs> Go Joe. Go Joe. Pati sa Disney. Gusto ko na pumunta ng Disney. Yeah. Girl. So, ayan. Girl. Um, what am I gonna buy? Yun nga, anime merch. <laughs> okay. Um, Nagkakasundo tayo dyan. Follow up na natin yan. Favorite top three anime off the top of your head without thinking. Go! Oh. Uh, Jujutsu, uh, Blue Lock, and... Uh, 
Um, psychic. Eh. <laughs> Any third? Psychic. Eh. Oh, okay. I heard about that. Yeah. Uh, oh, jujutsu. I like. Pero jujutsu is super. Ani di matslayer pa. Di matslayer. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Para marinig mo lang kay Bones. Bones, stop three. Off the top of your head. Hunter x Hunter, fairy tale, um, jujutsu. Oh. oh. Okay. Okay. One, two, three. Oh, okay. I really like Demon Slayer. Uh, I like Hunter x Hunter. Um, what's that called? The One Piece live action I really enjoy. That's not anime. Yeah, but it's like my first entry into the One Piece One universe. Piece. Okay. And so I'm in love. Ako, diba? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 I loved it. Oh watch the anime. Oh my god. Oh my god. I found, I found, <laughs> I found, I found Nami cute kasi, pero I really like kasi, sa totoo lang yung set na in love ako sa set. Mm. Yung world, the ship. Di- yung, yung world building nila. Mm. Sobrang galing. Yeah, galing. Super galing. Talagang, may, uh, binigyan nila ng hostisya yung budget nila. Para sa akin. So, dun talaga na, na, na ingan yung manood. Kasi, I was like, wow, parang ineforetan talaga. Minahal nila, kumbaga. Hindi yeah. lang trabaho. Yeah. Parang minahal ng lahat. Hindi lang yung actors, pero everyone in the production. So, nung napansin ko yun, and then, in fairness, maganda naman yung, yung talaga yung kwento, yung, yung pag-aarte. I was like, oh, I love this show. Alright, now we move on to Aidan. Ah, uh, sa akin, ang dami ko gusto bilhin mo. Gusto ko lang pera. I mean, I mean, no, just not being a straight man. Okay, so, si Aidan bibili ng pera. Yeah. With his pera. Yeah. <laughs> more more. Ko. Magaling ka, ha? Magaling ka. Pera. I, I think, either, a uh, new phone or a plane ticket Ooh. and a plane ticket to where? where at hindi pa ako decide pero like if like now ngayon ako pag uh, magde-decide ako now siguro i want to go back sa sa mom ko nga di ba na yeah. di ba na sa Australia sa Dubai parang ang tagal ko nang din pinakakabalik kasi usually every year kami po before pandemic every year kami almost like every year kami po pupunta ng uh, UAE then now kasi ang dami na nangyayari nag Dubai Expo and ang dami ng mga new uh, places there yes. then i want to go back there uh ano pa ba like korea so oh. pumunta sa south korea ano nga say yeah south korea so if mabibigyan ako ng vacation ng ganun siguro ganun yung gagawin ko and pero kapag ganun kasi sobrang tagal hindi ko kaya na parang wala akong masyadong ginagawa eh. parang like na pag nasa bahay lang yeah. or what para lagi akong naghanap ng way kung paano ko improve yung sarili ko like parang now um do may mga iba-ibang schedule katulad yes. nito mga events and stuff pero ngayon parang planning to what ano yung uh, parang next skill na oh, yeah, to yeah, matu- na, like, like that the ba sabi I'm planning to uh, voice lesson mm. <laughs> para may racket yan. para may racket sa mga ano <laughs> sa mga events sa mga probinsya ba yes. punin niyo po ako pag ano na pag pwede na pwede na kagaya ko siguro yung Mike eh, di ba may one song <laughs> may one song she Kinanta niya sa amin, one song siya na lagi niya kinakanta sa mga mm, sinabi uh, bawat ano yun. <laughs> master na master niya yung one song na yun. Uy, yung mga sikreto ko, sinishare. Yo, pero saan? Two songs naman. Oh, diba? Sa Tagalog at isang English. Sa Tagalog at isang English. So, eh. alam niyo na pag ano, nag-mall show si Mikael, isang kanta lang yan. Kasi, uh, ano na yan, na-perfect niya na. Hindi niya kailangan ng plus one. Yeah. Talagang boses niya na yun ah. Oo. Oh, na-master niya na. Then games na lang after. Games na <laughs> Danda na lang sa hosting. So, yun. So, I feel like if magko-Korea ako, siguro, I'm planning na, actually, I'm planning, if magko-Korea ako, mag-plan kong mag-enroll sa mga dance, dance. class. Oh dance God. class sa Korea. Kasi iba yung, iba yung training there. Yes. Iba yung, I mean, iba yung style. And, and watching the, from the Street Woman Fighter and Street Man Fighter, iba yung parang quality ng, at least, ayun, mas near, kaysa mag-US ako eh. Yes. A- mas malayo eh. So, parang, mas near sa akin, sa Philippines, which is South Korea. So, ganun. And yun, nagte-training naman din sila usually sa uh, US din eh. So, I feel like, though, ngayon, I'm planning naman din, nag-undergo ng mga um, workshops since, yeah, now. Though, wala pa kaming dance workshop na schedule. So, ngayon, nag, uh, nag-book ako ng, like, from my... Ayun, oh, yeah, on pa- your own. Yeah. Yeah. On pocket. Pocket, oh, wow, money ko talaga. Kasi sa GMA, sila may sagot, yes. diba? So, Kaya ngayon, ito ngayon. na, Lord, pengi daw pera pa si yeah. More projects pa. Para mag- mag- mapunta daw sa mga workshop niya. Yes. Maging masipin. Ang dami pa bang gusto ma-learn na even sports and um, martial arts or like mm-hmm. what? Diba, like, there's yeah. a lot of time, ah. There's a lot of yeah. time for you. Actually, dami kong, may parang one night yata, puro nag-research lang ako, ah, oh, saan ba yung maganda dito? Ano mo, pareho kayo? Nag-release ako. Pareho kayo ni Mikael? 
Exactly. Parang at the beginning of the year lagi. Lagi namin iniisip, ano kaya yung skill na pwede natin matutunan for yeah. this year? And let's focus on it. Like for example, for us this year, nag-focus kami sa running. Oh. Mas tumakbo kami this year at hindi talaga ako tumatakbo. As in, zero. Siguro mga once every six months. <laughs> Ganun ako dati. Siguro mga wala pang 10K. Hindi pa ako nakakatakbo ng 10K. Pero yun yung naging promise ko sa sarili ko. And even Mikael, that we will start running. So dapat every month, meron tayong at least a couple of runs in a month. Yeah. Okay, so we've wrapped up Royal Blood. And we've gotten to know you guys a little bit more. Now, I want to go back to work. Kasi lahat tayo, the common thread between all of us is we're all in yeah. showbiz. We're all working. We're all trying to make our money so we can spend on the different things. Go to Boracay, yeah. Tokyo, to Dubai, Tokyo as well. Yeah. So we want all these things. But I'm curious, since we're all in different age groups, what is mindset niyo towards work? Like, what is your goal? Niyo? Like especially you guys, you guys are starting and you guys are coming into it. You came, you're coming off a successful project, so and you're also, on, you're on a high. Yeah, know? and Sarap. also, for example, like Princess actually started out pretty young in the industry. Yeah. Like as in bata ka pa talaga nung no, start ka. So moving forward now na parang you're in your late teens, malapit na kayo maging adult. How do you see yourselves in the future? Any mga goals that you want to Yeah, or what do you want to grow into? FYI, uh, Princess is also an amazing singer, mm. so you guys might also have other talents that you want to develop or that you haven't shown. So curious lang ako. In terms of the work aspect, growing up five years, ten years from now, what do you imagine or you hope you grow your grow into? So start with Princess. Princess. <laughs> I don't <laughs> feel any pressure right now. <laughs> My family. Um, siguro, um, f- five to ten years from now. Well, any naman, any. Any, or just even now, parang how do you see yourself? Like, what would you like to be able to capitalize on? Mm. Do you want to focus on acting and singing equally or something more? Or should get into dancing? Curious lang ako, like, any mindset mo when you think about work nowadays? Um, actually, ang gusto ko talaga kasi um, maging pilot. So feeling ko, um, that's where I see myself ten years from now or five years from now. Gonna five years from now. Come point. Pero um, ano kasi uh, mas ino na ko muna ngayon yung um showbiz. Yeah. Um, kasi parang feeling ko, ito talaga yung parang yung opportunity kasi yes. ngayon ngayon ng so why not, de ba? Um, pero syempre hindi ko pa rin pinapabaya yung studies ko kasi kung ako papipiliin showbiz or um, pag ano uh, feeling ko pilot talaga. Oh. So, um, if kunyari um, okay na ako dito sa showbiz, ano, pick I'm gonna quit tapos mas magfo-focus na talaga ako as ano, a professional pilot. Wow, wow. Very, interesting. very interesting. Very interesting. Follow-up question. What if let's say everything works out for you? Yeah. And you become, you know, a bigger star than you imagined. Would you put your dreams of becoming a pilot on hold to maintain the opportunity at hand? Yun nga din po eh. Kasi yun din sabi ng ate ko, if syempre dito ko na talaga mag, ano, mag, maging mag-boom, like, mag, uh, ano ko na ba sa pilot or parang like, kukuha na lang ako ng license at hindi, na, hindi ko na ipopursue talaga yung pagka-pilot. Um, yun yung crisis ko ngayon, pero feeling ko naman, mas, ewan ko, parang nai-inlove na din talaga ako dito sa work na to eh. So, pero, pilot talaga. Mm-mm. Okay. Interesting. So, pilot, but see where that. life takes you. Mm-hmm. Yeah. A very interesting backstory lang, si Fofo. Dapat magbabanker siya noon. Mm-hmm. So, I was a business management graduate, and then, uh, but, 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 volu- minor in finance voluntary pa. minor in finance. <laughs> So, ginusto ko talaga, eh, nakala ko talaga yun na yun. I, didn't, I had no inclinations of going to showbiz or anything arts related. So, yun lang, share ko lang. But, ang ending ko is here. And Christoph Royale. Christoph Royale. <laughs> Christoph Royale. <laughs> Nangaaway ng kabayo sa huling eksena ng project niya. So, yun yung ending ko. Life takes you to uh, many different places yeah. in unexpected ways and yeah. timings. Well, but that's I'm, very interesting. I like, I yeah. like that. I like hearing that. And I, I love hearing that you're open to anything. Because it's hard to say that it's just this. Mm-hmm. But what if something else happens mm-hmm. for you? So it's great to hear that you're open to any kind of possibility, but also keeping your heart open to your dreams. 
Yeah. yeah. Okay. Next. Okay, then. Um. Siguro like growing up kasi hindi ko na I mean lumaki ako sa household na yung pag-artista is not a career mm. or is not a talagang job. Yeah. Okay. So parang before then like we're the same kasi I was talagang bata pa lang ako kasi nga nagta-travel travel yeah. kami. Gusto ko maging pilot para lang yung perks na travel gusto ko nasa airplane ako. Yeah. Tapos nandoon ako sa sky, ganyan ganyan eh, chill chill lang naman yung pilot doon. Ganun ganun lang naman sila, <laughs> di ba? <laughs> I mean, sorry, 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 sorry. Hindi, I mean, may pressure pa rin. Kung maging pilot ka, hindi ako lilipad ka sa mga ha? I mean, may pressure pa rin naman. Pero kasi diba mayroon option na autopilot or what? So, like, hindi ganun so, sobrang matrabaho. And sabi ko, okay, if hindi kaya ng, if hindi ako maging pilot. Not as physical. Yeah. Not as physical. If approach. hindi man ako mag-pilot, flight attendant. Sabi ko, flight attendant. Parang basta gusto ko, nandun ako nag-work sa, sa uh, aircraft. Then, parang sabi ko, ay, parang posible na yun. Parang ayaw masyadong, uh, yung, mahirap pala yung time na yun or what, yeah. ganyan, ganyan. Then, uh, family ko, pinupush ako sa medicine. <laughs> then, uh, nagtatry ako doon. Then, parang nagkaroon ako uh, introduction about sa uh, mga medical courses and stuff. Then, eventually, bata pa lang kasi talaga ako. Parang, I always see myself nasa TV. Yeah. Then, may that, dream, uh, may dream na ako. Pero like, in the whole bank nila ako, ayaw nila kasi, hindi nga, for them, it's not a proper job talaga job, ayun, yeah. profession professional they, job oh yeah. yeah for them ayun lang ayun lang po sa family ko ah di ayun nila yung yung ano yeah don't worry. di naman sa ano don't worry. Di you're not the only yeah. one out there not oh, really not the only one don't so worry. Pa, so ayun having family stuff ah yeah yeah ah, sa bagay yeah. so parang ganun na uh, tinatay nila yung uh, wag 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 kang i-push yan mm-hmm. ganyan sa yung pag-aaral ko sabi nila sa yung um, honor student kasi sa yung talino mo kung kung di mo di magamit or what, then nung nag-enter ako ng showbiz, I'm very much aware na this is a craft na. It's an art. art kaya, kaya nung nag-enter ako, talagang decided na ako na, okay, yes, eto na yung gusto kong path. Before ako, kasi para ang dami pang nag- 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 nagtatry ang audition, then biglang mag-focus sa studies kasi ayun yung gusto ng parents. Then, parang mawawala na yung dream. Sabi ko, ah, it's impossible na sa akin. Parang, um, sige, mag- maging doctor na lang ako ni gusto nila or what. Then eventually, nag-pandemic. Then sabi ko, ah, life is short. Parang gusto ko na lang anong gawin ko, anong gusto ko. Then, yeah. bigla naman nila akong, siguro, pinilit ang pinilit ko din yung parents ko. Then, na- napao ko din sila. Then, nakita din nila siguro kung gano'ng ako pers- persegido na ah, gawin yung ah, gusto ko talagang gawin. Then, I'm really talaga into uh, film. Siguro kung di man ako artist or like mag... Uh, of course, merong... I feel like dun papunta yung ano eh, career ko, like, either like acting ako or like nasa production. Mm-hmm. Gusto ko maging film director or like like direct dom. Yeah. <laughs> direct dom or like producer or what. Gusto ko nand- nandito pa na sa industry. Yeah. So nakikita ko yung sarili ko like tinanong nga nila ako nung audition ko. Sabi ko, I always see myself like working in this field. Hindi man, kahit di man ako actor or artist, no, behind the cam. Yes. Okay. So ayun. Okay. Love so, ayun. I love it. Oh. Very, very much like uh, Diana and Kristoff. Yes. Yes. Okay. So pa sa akin, siguro okay. like naka-help sa akin yun na na talagang maging seryoso sa work ko dahil for me it's a craft talaga, it's a discipline mm-hmm. and it's an art. It's my way talaga to um parang naging outlet ko siya para express yung mga hindi ko ma-express sa normal na yes. setup na na like, oh, na buhay na yung mga emotion na hindi ko naman pwedeng malabas. So through that naging uh, parang comfort zone ko siya. Alright, yeah, let's move on to James. Uh, growing up, I always loved watching TV until now. Uh, so, pag tingin may nakikita po akong mga bata kagaya ko sa TV, mm-hmm. sabi ko, I wanna be like that. <laughs> now po na, na nandito na ako, ang main goal ko po talaga ngayon is mag-ipon. Kasi ang pangako po talaga sarili ko magiging neurosurgeon ako. Wow! Wow! Um, In fairness! So, actually, nung bata ako gusto ko din mag-pilot. Pero, mm. like, parang na-inspire ako nung while well, I was watching this show called uh, yung doctor po siya na may autism. Ah, yes. yes. Parang na-inspire po ako ng sobra doon na gusto ko din, parang gusto ko din mong surgeon. Paghihirapan ko to mag-iipon ako para mm. dito. Nako, I love Hindi it. Hindi pa lang pilot, in fairness, ha? Oo, ha? Ba't may, never ko naisip maging pilot. <laughs> Ako, ano ba? Gusto ko lang... Never mo rin naisip maging pilot. Naisip ko lang magsulat, ganun. <laughs> pilot, hindi. <laughs> sulat ng... Gusto ko maging editor-in-chief dating ng magazine. Yun yung wow. dream ko nung bata. Kasi mahilig ako magbasa ng magazine. Mm. At uso pa nun yung bibili ka ng magazine. Yeah. Sabi ko, gusto ko maging editor-in-chief. Okay. 
Okay, so before we have the quick game, so this is the last part of the podcast. But before we get to that, if ever you guys have anything you guys want to ask us, this is also your time. So yeah, chika chika mug tayo. Kahit ano naman eh. And then before we'll close with our short game. So go go for it. You guys have anything? <laughs> Nakayaan. <laughs> Okay, okay lang naman. Anything, any follow-up dun sa questions sa tinanong namin. Because if not, it's okay. Kahit out of the blue. Okay. Of the blue. It doesn't matter. It doesn't have to be connected to anything. But... Kahit hindi connected sa Royal Blood. Okay, oh, okay lang din naman. Or if you want to ask it later kasi you feel na nahihiya kayo sa podcast, then it's okay also. Yeah. Uh, about po to sa Royal Blood, paano, okay, okay. paano po kayo nag-prepare sa character ninyo? Very interesting. Yeah. Okay, go. Thoughts. Um... Ako, nag-ano ako eh. Uh, meron akong music na pinapakinggan before I get into heavy scenes for Diana. At very specific yung uh, song na yun. It's uh, the Billie Eilish yeah. song from what was, I made for? what Was I Made For. Especially towards the end. Kasi parang feeling ko, mas dun yung hugot ni Diana, yung darkness mm. niya. Because of the melody also of the song, parang dun nakakahugot si Diana. But because... Megan is so different from Diana. I really have to pretend that I'm her. So, pati boses, iniiba ko. And just different characteristics. Kasi my natural voice is higher. Talaga. So, pag Diana, mas mababa, yeah. mas mabagal, ako magsalita. So, I just figured out different ways of how to differentiate Diana from Megan. Para pag ginawa ko yun, binabaan ko yung boses ko, mas mabagal ako magsalita mas natutulungan ko yung sarili ko to jump mm. into character. At mas mabagal din ako kumilos. Hindi ako natataranta. Mm. Hindi ako parang, ah, 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 saan yung gamit ko? Kasi Megan yun eh. <laughs> yeah. ah, 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 ah. Megan yun. <laughs> Pero pag si Diana, mas sure sa sarili nga, mas, hindi, ito Kaya. tayo. Ito, mm-hmm. game. Okay. So that's how I get into character. Basically, kailangan mag-iba ako ng mga gagawin ko. Tsaka mm-hmm. napansin ko din po, parang iba din po yung mata niyo pag Diana kay parang, deadpan talaga yeah. no very ano um soulless pag si Diana ginaw oh, mas ginawa ng ano konti ano yan hindi ko alam ginawa mo ba na parang mga um, mannerism si Diana and yes. the nonsense yes parang, yung mga ganoon yeah. sa ulo ginawa ko for Diana and hindi ako ano eh hindi ako touchy pag si Diana kasi mm-hmm. pag Megan more on mahilig ako ganyan gumanyan yan pero since medyo i want to keep my safe zone only kay Archie lang yeah. ako humahawa kasi I'm protecting you. So yun. Pet, pet. Yeah. Yeah. Pet, pet. Yeah, yun yung relationship ng ano, mother and son yeah. sa ano. Yeah, super. So parang Action, things yeah. like that help me. Kasi before, hindi ginagawa yun eh. Mm. Parang naiisip ko lang, ah, okay, ganito lang ako umacting. Tapos kung ano lang yung nafe-feel ko. But, <laughs> I mean, that was That's me. so true. That was me being very, parang carefree and just going with the flow. <laughs> Magbabasa ng exam sa Megan. Oh, oh, my character is happy. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> Grabe. As in, walang, hello, girl. Pag-isipan mo naman. So I really made sure na parang after pandemic, if ever I get into a show na... <laughs> Mas precise yung gagawin ko, mm. mas may intention ang lahat ng gagawin ko. So that's how I prepared for Diana. What about you? How did you prepare for Crystal? <laughs> but anyway, sige, to, to, no, 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 to, to, I guess, summarize a little bit. Ako naman, I had quite the journey through acting and learning it. I had a difficult, difficult time. And even now, I still find it extremely difficult. But a lot of changes happened. So I'm not sure kung paano ko yung tinuturo sa mga workshop. Mm. But when I first started, ang tinuturo sa akin is try to substitute mo na. Like parang kung ano yung feeling mo. I'm sure mm. yun yung advice uh, na binibigay yeah. sa inyo. Yeah. Substitute something personal. Or maybe you look at someone's eyes mm. and then imagine that they're that person who matters a lot to yeah. you. Para lang makugot mo yung yeah. emotion. Pero sa totoo lang, I would use that. It would work. But I always had such a hard time because it's like my brain was doing two things at the same time. Yeah. I was trying to be with the character at the same time. I tried to imagine that this mm-hmm. sibling maybe was my real sibling. I was like, I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. And especially, lalo heavy scene, diba? I was like, 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 So I was like, I always had that hard, uh, difficult time trying to reconcile na, okay, imagine someone else and be this character. Yeah. And then eventually, I got to the point na I became familiar with it. I became more familiar with the feelings. And then so my goal of getting into character is making sure na I'm in that character and really knowing the feelings. So a super quick example of that is Christoph. 
So when is Christo- when Christoph is mad, I just need to know what's the trigger of Christoph. Because I know the feeling of being angry. Kung, let's say my sinagasaan si nasagasaan si Soma or whatever, I'd be super duper mad. But I know that that triggers me. So what would trigger Christoph? Nakalagay naman dun sa script, eh, diba? So parang, ay, okay, um, nakita ko yung mukha ni Napoy. I don't like Napoy. I know what kind of, an, alam ko na yung feeling ng rage na yun, eh. So I just need to make sure that I feel that rage as Christoph. But of course, yeah. I do that kasi ilang beses ko natin na yung iba't ibang mga techniques and then parang ito na lang nag-work para sa akin. Yeah. So you guys, will, some of you will be super natural in terms of acting. Others will have to work harder. But as you try different things, you you'll also out find what out what works. It's not just one thing. Usually yeah. it's a mixture of different things awesome. and experiences. Kaya sabi ko nga kay uh, Aidan, always go to the workshops. Kasi lahat yan, parang ma- mabubuo yung style niyo over time. Eh. Yeah, Hindi man instant. So just keep trying. Lang. And honestly, what works for one show, Oh, may sa next show yeah. ibang yeah. Oh, system might yeah. work for you so importante talaga yung tuloy-tuloy lang yung workshops kasi you never know what's gonna change mm-hmm. in your life and what's gonna work. ano yung mga nakukuha yung hugot as you get older syempre nag-iiba din tayo as people habang tumatanda tayo so mm-hmm. all in all po matututo ka po through experience and, and through trying yeah. yeah and really trying some people say experience parang they'll just go with the flow hindi kailangan Subukan mo rin talaga. Yeah. Kailangan, you need to try. Also because some people are just naturally talented. Oh, but then, yeah. diba, may yeah. iba na parang, they don't even need to try, magaling na sila. Oh, oh. But then, for a lot of people yeah. also, you really have to work hard para ma-achieve mo yung gusto mo. And for us, we really had to work hard yeah. to get to Diana and Christoph. Mm. And parang even yung thought process namin as actors, uh, as celebrities working on the set, it took a while for us to parang figure out what really worked for us. So, mahanap nyo rin yung para sa inyo eventually. Anything else? Um, add a question. What, ano yung biggest lesson yung na-learn nyo sa buong showbiz career nyo na ma-advise nyo sa amin tatlo since we're starting? Oh, mm. interesting. Ako general, general advice na easy to adapt to, but something you always have to keep in mind is to always be nice. Mm. Always be the better person in any situation. Kahit na feeling mo na, oh my God, nakakainis na talaga tong nangyari sa buhay ko. Yeah. Take a step back always. Okay. Don't react with emotion. And nakuha namin, like, I watched an interview of Kobe before. Sabi niya... Kobe Bryant. Kobe Bryant. Parang, sorry, close kami. <laughs> Kobe Bryant, sabi niya, don't ever react on pure emotion. Kasi, mm. because if you're at a high emotion, it'll... I don't, you might end up saying the wrong thing yeah. or you might end up hurting someone in the process. Always take a step back mm-hmm. and assess that moment. Kasi baka mamaya magkamali ka. So always take a step back, always be nice, always try to be the better person. Mm-hmm. Kasi maliit lang ang mundo ng showbiz. Hindi mo alam kung sino yung makaka-work mo in the future na baka mamaya yung umaaway sa'yo. Sila pala yung nagpapakain sa'yo. So how do you parang really assess a situation like that. So, yun. Mm-hmm. That would be my advice. Ako, I mean, I was gonna say save, Ipon, but a lot of people are gonna tell you that already. Mm-hmm. So, something a bit different is be adventurous. Wow. Experiment. Sample lang to. Okay, super quick sample. I said I was a management major and I went showbiz. That was a huge risk. Pero go ako. I was willing. I was willing to jump and look what was on the other side of the fence. Sample a bit closer to home for you guys. Si B, Lian. Oh, yeah. Si Lian, um, I think her breakout role was uh, okay, si Stella. Stella. And Stella. kabit yung character yeah. na dun. Tumalun yeah. siya dun. Nag-experiment At bata pa siya dun. Eh. She wasn't sure. Kahit bata siya, sabi niya, sige, go lang. It worked wonders for her. And I think you'll see that as a trend for a lot of people that when they jump and do something Outside out of, of the ordinary, concern. May may realize sila, and usually there's always something on the other side of that. Mm-hmm. Usually it doesn't, doesn't it isn't always success, but it's usually something memorable and fun. Mm-hmm. So be adventurous. Yeah. Ako naman, one more example, okay. even within showbiz. So pinili ko yung showbiz. That was a big jump for me. A huge example of that was that so I was trying to learn how to act, 
He's trying mm-hmm. to learn how to be dramatic and everything, <laughs> right? yeah. how to cry and all of that. And then all of a sudden, on like my third or fourth year, sabi na, oh, gusto mo ba mag bubble gum? Huh? Okay. And I was a uh, regular and semi-regular bubble gum cast member for I think six or seven years. Out of that yeah. first taping day, I got out that first taping day. So you just never know. And yeah. the commit lang ako. I don't think I was any good. I think I, I developed that skill. Pero yung nakita lang nila na ay willing siya kahit medyo wala siguro. <laughs> <laughs> Alam mo yung natuwa lang sa yon. That matters. Kasi yeah. syempre, it matters na biglang yeah. nagpakita ng willingness. Gilas, yung gilas kahit later on na yon. Basta willingness. Matutuwa ka yung yeah. mga tao sa yon. Eh. So for me, go lang ng go. Take the jump. And then if kung natatakot kayo, always talk to your friends, your family, you can talk to us. Okay lang naman yun. So yun, okay, yun lang. Yun lang sa akin. Yeah. Any other questions before we move on to the red shop? Any, any, any? Good? 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 G-G-G. All right, game, game, game. All right, let's move on now to the red shops with Bones and Fofo. But just a disclaimer that I put under age of my guests. Namin, walang alak for today's episode. Puro juice lang at spicy. So, magkakaroon ng representative na lang. So, you have to pick one shot. And kung masagot nyo lahat, then hindi niya kailangan uminom. Pero kung ayaw niyo sagutin, oh. then that person has to drink. We want quick hitters here. We'll start with James and then we'll end with Aidan. The question is, sino ang pinaka-favorite mong ka-eksena among your co-stars in Royal Blood? And oh. why? Uh, si Kuya Dion. Si Kuya Dion kasi parang kagaya ng sinabi ko kanina, parang tatay ko na siya dun. Just medyo close din po kami mm-hmm. dahil mahilig siya mag, mag-skate sa land. Yeah. Mahilig ako mag-skate sa ice. Mm-hmm. So parang meron kaming... May connection kayo dun. Mm-hmm. Okay. Alright. Skaters. All right. Princess. Um, ako din, siguro si Mom Dizzy at Rian, kasi um, actually mas madami kami eksena. Mas madami kami eksena ba kaysa sa Luyenan? Or... Mm-hmm. Oh, mas madami. Okay, and yun nga, nakaka-relate ako, sibling rivalry, ganun. Mm-hmm. So, yun. Hey, Dan. Hindi ka inom. Oh, saan? Mom and Dad. Oh? Yeah, yes. Wait, And, sinong dad? Yung real dad? No, no, no. The, si Christoph? Like, yeah, si Christoph. Real dad. Oh, real dad. You're not my real dad. Sorry. So, ayun. I feel like... Safe ka na. Ayun, safe, safe na ako. Na, safe na. Okay. Wait, ano to? So, I'll try. Ako. Pero, ah, sige. Juice. Apple. Okay, go try mo. Sige, na, try mo na. Sure. <laughs> go try mo. Okay to. Parang patis. Parang makasin eh. Oh, it's good. Juice, juice, juice. Juice, okay. juice. All right. Okay, next one. Parang gusto tuloy ni Princess. Oh, okay, James. Apple Ay, juice. Yan. Okay, next one. Wait, choose the shot. Choose the shot. For Princess. Okay, let's give her the scary shot. Okay, game. Okay. That is Princess. Kaya ako sa go na go ako. Hindi na ako okay. sasagot sa dalo. Oh, pinlaan oh. <laughs> na the joke. Okay, so next one, we'll start with Aiden naman, then Princess. Kailangan and James. Kailangan ng busin pag i-shot. Oh, naman! Kaya mm-hmm. naman. Sige, G, G. Okay, G. Okay. G. So, the question is, Sino ang aktor or aktres ang hindi mo gusto or natatakot ka makawork in the future? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, pinili ka, tal- pinili ka talaga yung pinakamahirap. Sige, pwede mo ipaba muna. Oh, ipaba mo muna. Okay, Aidan, go. Ala ko na! Aidan, sa mga tatak! Ala ko na! Wala, showbiz! <laughs> wala naman, okay naman lang sila. Pag hindi ka sumagot, iinom oh, si Yano. Okay, kaso kung wala, iinom si Princess. Wait lang. Kailangan mag-isip. Okay. So, okay, kasi wala pa naman ang bad, super bad experience. Or natatakot kang makatrabaho. Yun nga, natatakot. Um, Nako. Natatakot. Nakatingin na siya sa akin. Sino ba? May natatakot, bigyan niyo ang idea. <laughs> Oo, oh, nata- nakatingin na yung palaka sa'yo. <laughs> Parang sarap, guys. <laughs> Hala! Ta- Hala! Wala na! O, Aidan! Skip ka na! Princess! Sige. Wala din ako masagot. Okay. Okay, okay. 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 Sige, wala ako. Hindi naman sa ayaw ko katrabaho, pero nataan na tatakot. Okay, go, go, go. Okay. Ano, natatakot ako kay Sir Ding Dong nun. Ah! Oh, really? Oo, oh, oh. oh, yung, yung, yung birthday ni Archie, natatakot ako sa kanya nun dahil lagi ko siya napapanood sa TV dati na I actually look up to him. So parang natatakot ako baka magkamali ako. Ay, okay. Pero dahil si James lang yung nakasagot, Princess! You know, may juice naman dito. No, kahit, kahit half lang, okay lang naman. Yeah. Okay. May juice naman just in case. Okay. 
Go! Ay, ito yung spicy eh. Hindi ko nga alam kung kaya ni Pri. Wala, grabe siya. Uy, ano yun talaga yun? Uy, kailangan mo ba ng chaser? Ano yun? Hindi, ito, ito. Sara? Ay, okay. Ito, ano yun? Ano yun? Ano nilagay niyo? Hot sauce and honey. Honey! Kaya pala! Sweet and sour. Okay, oh, James, James, James. Sa'yo to, sa'yo to, sa'yo to. Ang hang! Ito, 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 may juice. Ito, ito. Woo! Wait lang, wait lang. Go, go, go. Hot sauce and honey. Okay. Okay, okay. Game. So for James, we'll start to... Uh, Princess will answer first, then Aidan, and then James. Pero si James yung kukuha niya. So the last question is, Sino naman ang gusto niyong makatrabahong kapuso star? And why? One Dali. Lang. Madali lang. Madali masyad. Oh, go, go, go. Mabait tayo. Mabait. Um, siguro po si... Si Miss Marian. Kasi, um... Dapat ano, nung pan- bago mag-pandemic po, magkakashow kami yung mm-hmm. first yaya. Kaso, kaso ka nag-pandemic ba ako, yung mga bata, tapos yeah. na ah, So, okay. di na tuloy. Tapos, after yung pandemic, tapos ano, royal blood, so nakatrabaho ko sa Sir Ding Dong. So, ngayon, si ating primetime queen naman, si Miss Maria. Okay. Nice, okay. nice. Aidan, oh, Aidan. Uh, so, same with her. So, din makawork si uh, Miss Maria since nakawork ko si Kuya Dong mm-hmm. dito and super nice. And, Uh, aside from Miss Marian, si Ati Barbie, Barbie ah, Fortes. Yes. So hopefully, mag-work kami soon. Hopefully, okay. hopefully. Okay, James, na hindi na kailangan uminom. Ako po sasagot. Oo, oh, ikaw sasagot. Hindi uh, daw siya sasagot eh. Si, si Kuya Kenshan po. Ah, Pero aside sa kanya, gusto ko maka-work ulit yung Roy- Royal Bloodcast. What's that? Yeah. Yeah. That's my man! <laughs> That's my man! <laughs> <laughs> Ay, gusto ko yan, gusto ko yan. So, di mo na kailangan uminom. But before we end, actually, you kind of hit the nail on the head. I have a question for all of you. I'm just curious. Um, bata pa kayo, for some of you, uh, Royal Blood was, I guess, your biggest or most... I memorable. Guess, mem- most memorable or most intimidating project to a certain extent. So, ano yung mga nabasag na misconceptions para sa inyo in terms of the cast? Diba? Oh. I'm sure may assumptions kayo about the cast. Yun nga, intimidating. Maka yung unang eksena mo, maybe with Ding Dong Dantes. So, maybe with Tears of Cruz, maybe yeah. with us, maybe with Rian. Meron ba kayong misconception or may narinig tapos no pumasok na kayo sa set na confirm or na hindi na confirm? Meron ba? Meron ba? Kasi ako, I always had. Ah, okay. I've always had about different people in any set. In any okay. set. So I was always curious. Um, anong tawag ito? I'll go back to my very first one. In Amaya. Uh, I was working with Marian and Vera for the very first time. And then of course, uh, you would hear different rumors about her. And people would possibly say na, hindi, baka hindi yun mabait sa'yo. But I saw com- someone completely different when I went on set. She mm-hmm. was extremely nice to me. And she was extremely yeah. professional. To the point na I always say, and kwento ko lagi, that I learned how to be professional because... because my first partner in a show was Marian Rivera. Yeah. And she was so professional, or at least yun yung nakuha ko sa kanya, na naisip ko, ah, okay, this is what a professional mm-hmm. should be. So ito yung standards ko. Mm-hmm. So dahil sa kanya, she set the standards of professionalism very high for me. At least yun yung naging experience ko. It's always different for people. So yun lang. So I'm curious kung meron kayong ganong experience here, maybe with Direct Dome or any of the other mm-hmm. actors. And kung wala, then that's okay. Ako meron akong isa. Ago. Kasi dati naka-work ko si Dong sa Alias Robin Hood. Na machika naman siya. Pero hindi ko kasi alam yung ibang side niya. Like how he is as a person. Mm-hmm. Tapos na naka-work natin ulit siya sa Royal Blood. Na-realize ko, sobrang kalog pala niya. <laughs> Parang deep inside, may kalog factor pala siya na mahilig siya mag-joke at makitawa. At yung mga hilig niya pala sa TikTok, di ba na-reveal niya yung mga food na tinitignan niya sa... TikTok. So parang it was just a different side of him. Now, I always saw him as quiet mm-hmm. and very serious type of person. Tapos nung naka-work ko ulit siya, parang nakakalug ka pala. Yeah. Kayo, okay. meron ba kayo? Mm-hmm. Siguro ako yung um, si Ate Lian. Oh. Kasi nung nag-photoshoot mm-hmm. kami noon, parang nakasabay ko siya para magpaswap. Okay. Tapos nakita ko siya, nasa van na siya. Sa kaganyan siya, tapos parang, Tara. parang ano, kung So, like, sabi ko, hello po. Tapos hindi, 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 hindi siya tumingin. No? Tapos sabi ko, ano, shocks, paano to? <laughs> parang ano, 
Pinarayan ka agad. <laughs> Tapos, so like, akal, akala ko talaga parang, um, very serious siyang tao, mm-hmm. ganun, tatakot. Natakot talaga ako Ooh. sa kanya nun. Tapos, as B na siya. O, oh, nang yeah, nang nagpaswab ba kami, ganun. Tapos sabi ko, pwede po bang tuba- to dumaan muna? At sabi nung isang handle nyo, hindi po, unahin mo siya ng ano, baka, baka nagigirita na. <laughs> so sabi ko, sige po, sige po, inalatawad na nila. Ay, that's, so that's so funny, that's so funny. I pero, love Pero ayun, pero nung ano pa, sobrang ano pala niya, sobrang kulit. Super. Tapos mag- sobrang bait din, so yeah. ano. <laughs> Pero ikakwento din natin do kay Lian bago mag-air yung podcast na, Uy, alam mo ba, akala ni Princess din na Ryan mo siya. Hindi, sasabihin natin, Uy, sabi ni Princess ang taray mo. Okay, 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 okay. okay. Ay, Dan, meron ka ba? Oh, uh, same with, with her na, I thought si Ate Lian tali, parang unapproachable or like, uh, kasi yung character niya sa Stella, like, uh, di ba, parang uh, very, very kontrabida, parang maldita or what. Then, nung, parang, na, I remember kasi kami lagi magkasabay sa van eh. Yeah. Kasi magkalapit yeah, ang kondo namin yes. eh. Tapos siya pa yung mag-upper, Ay, eh, nandito ka na umupo. Sa, what? Pinapupo ko sa tabi natin niya. <laughs> so, parang sa, what? Parang, ibang-iba. Yes. Like, dun sa napapanood ko. Then, I thought, nung, before nung photoshoot natin, syempre, kasi alam ko mga work ko, uh, dad ko is, uh, Kuya Mika, Mik, and Ate Meg, uh, mom ko. So, I thought na, like, hindi ko ma-approach masyado or hindi ko makakausap or parang unreachable or what. Then, pa- ang, ang idea ko talaga kay Kuya Mick, siya yung parang super serious type na person. Hindi ba ako na parang, <laughs> na parang lagi siyang may goal or what na kailangan ma-reach to ganito yung target natin or what. Tapos, si Ate Meg naman parang, kasi syempre Miss World or what. Mm. So parang si, ang high or mataas and ako ang starting. So I feel like merong gap. Yeah. Then, nung nag-work kami, I remember first uh, kita natin ng photoshoot tinanong niyo ako kung about sa character if may concern na or what kausapin ko lang kayo then yeah. kaya naging first impression ko nun, very collaborative kayo dalawa as colleagues uh-huh. then no na sa taping na no sa taping na hindi ko alam kuya big sobrang kalog <laughs> sobrang funny pala niya sabi ko sa nang galing to serious ako <laughs> sabi ko sa Saan nang galing ito? Sabi ko, mali, mali yung, ano, yung first impression. Impression, impression ko sa kanya. Tapos, si Ate Meg naman laging, uh, yung ba ganyan? As, as mom, as mom, very mom siya doon. So, like, ayun, na-appreciate ko. Then, nagulat din ako, Kuya Dong, na sobrang approachable. Siya pa yung, to the point na siya yung mag approach mm-hmm. sa'yo. Yeah. Like, for example, no, kayo sa scene, tapos, super, nasa set na ako, nasa, in character na ako as Archie, nakafocus na ako doon. Tapos, hindi ko alam na, nandiyan na pala siya duma- dumating sa set. Siya pala, oy, Archie, kamusta? Okay ba? Kamusta yung weekends mo? Ganyan. Siya pa yung magtatanong sa akin na siya mag-open up ng conversation. Nice. Nice, nice. I like, I like hearing parang yung mga misconceptions din. Kasi kahit kami nung pumasok kami, we also had, I guess, ideas kung about the artistas that we would work with. Napaka nakakatakot naman silang makasama. Mm-hmm. But the important thing is, you always try and always approach. You yeah. never know, di ba? You never know, baka totoo yung assumption siya. <laughs> <laughs> Marami akong kwenteng gano'n. But we'll save it for... Another time. Off camera. <laughs> yeah, but with that, I think we have reached the end of our Yay! podcast and our conversation. Yay! 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 What's up? Even sila sobat. And at the same time, yeah. kulit-kulit na lang. Yeah, okay. oh. Oh. Gusto na nilang maglaro. Oh, you can hold this yeah. for some. But with that, thank you so much for joining yes, us. I super enjoyed it. I got to know you guys a bit more. Itutuloy natin yung K-Mall YouTube video yeah. natin. We're gonna yes. do that. But with that, that ends our episode. Thank you so much for joining us. Bye, guys. Bye. Thank you so much.